Yo, chat, what is up? What is up, chat? Welcome, welcome to the Bugsy stream. Yo, 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 chat. Make sure you smash that like button if you're just joining us. Hit that like button. Help us get to that first 30 in 30 chat. Sorry, we are late. We are late, chat. My Discord is acting up on my computer. I'm not able to get it. I've downloaded it. I've re-downloaded it. Started over. Yeah. I don't know what to say, chat. Don't know what to say. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the Bugsy stream chat. If you are just joining us, make sure you smash that like button chat. Yo! Help us get to that first 30 in 30 chat. Let me see. Danny says, Bugsy! Yo, Danny, what is up? chat what is up danny says morning brother morning homie what is up how's everybody doing tonight welcome welcome to the stream chat it's gonna be wild night maybe you never know right hey guys oh damn it's ernie up in here hey what's up ernie hey what's up what are you guys up to well, I called my lawyer just a little bit ago. He's um, he's doing something, but he's, I'm about to meet up with him in a little bit. Nice, nice. That's what's up. Are Willie and Bubba awake? Yeah, we're at we're at we're at, we're at Legion Garage. Nice. How you guys doing tonight? Yo, chat, if you're just joining us, make sure you hit that like button. I don't know if our likes are broken or if nobody's hitting that like button. Smash that like button, chat. Help us get to that 30 and 30. Yo, Justin coming in with that like. Say what? I'm just nothing. I'm just kidding. Ernie, can you come to the warehouse? I mean, not the warehouse. Can you come to the Legion Garage? How do we lose 70 points? Sure. Hold on. Hey, we need a tank radio. Okay. On the same radio, we need, we need to change radios. Really? Okay. I mean, I'm down. I'm down. Yo, Brian, Brennan, coming with those likes. Justin, appreciate those likes, chat. Okay, well, go, go, in, uh, go in the warehouse and put it on the paper and put it on the floor. Why? So everybody can see it, but we ain't got to say it out loud. Yeah, that way everybody can see it. Or I could just we could just say it right here. What, the, What's happening? Yo, yeah, Jay, coming in with that like chat. I don't think I'm getting my updates yeah, of all the likes. Here, write it down on this notepad, right? right? They might be coming okay. through. Oh, it's just like a new radio. We could just text each other. Yeah, you could just text it. No, we could just we text could, each other. We could translate it into Braille. Okay, yeah, do that. Let me get my finger out. Well, what's the point of doing that? Bend over, Bubba. We can't just have it out in the open. We gotta, we gotta <laughs> Jay says, yo, Justice is there's my man Ernie. What's up, homie? Yo! Yo, what's up, chat? How's everybody's night? Hit that like button if you haven't hit it yet. We're at six reactions. We're trying to get to that 30 in the first 30 minutes. Jim, come in with that like. What? Billy with that like. Yo, I appreciate it. That's my favorite number. I know why. Really? What's your favorite number? Hello? Can we do... Hello? Can we do a point three? What's wrong with two? Because it doesn't go with the numbers right, you fat bastard. Exactly, one off. I don't like it. Point, point three for Dale. OCD. Four, point three for Dale. Okay, where is it? Point three for Dale. Hell where yeah. is it? Four, five, six, point three. Yeah. I'm whispering. Hey, y'all wanna go to Life Invader? So it's like three, four, five, six with the three. Hey! The exactly. Hey, hey. Hey! Hey, this is, this is the secret of Bobo Radio. Okay. Hello? Hello? Yo, Jim Hello? coming in with that 50 stars! Nerdy! Hobo's on tap, baby! Yo, Jim! Chat, it's gonna be crazy tonight! We got some stuff that we might... That just might have to happen, you never know. No, I'm just kidding. 
that they don't they don't get the four five six, four one nine nine four, four, five, six, it's the four one nine yo appreciate that archie with that like hey, I'm josh with, with that like oh, y'all want to go yo uh, if you haven't hit that like button we're at 10 reactions we are 30 percent the way 33 percent the way there hey mike if you want to ride with willie you can real quick i'm gonna talk we're gonna talk about all right all right willie take mike with you baby hop in megan <laughs> Pokey, you gonna stay here? You gonna go with him, or you gonna? We gonna talk about? All right. Hey, man, just put your hands down. Hey, Bo, how's everything going? What up, Bo? What's up, guys? What's up, guys? How's the chilling world with the HCT? Oh, not too bad, not too bad. Just Jeremy get, uh, coming with that like, appreciate that. With, uh, strawberry today. Still All right. Good. Very nice. That's good. That's good. Any new hires? Um, no, other than strawberry, and that's about okay. it. Okay. Right. Have, have you organized, uh, do you have any ride-alongs planned with Harry or the other guys yet, or? Uh, Harry, yes, I, I'm trying to work around his schedule because I know he's sleeps a lot for his other things. Right. Yeah. Um. He just mainly I, needs one, the final. Yeah. Um, the, what's his name? Uh. What was Jason, what's up with the naughty rhythm? I don't, I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know. I can't wait any longer either. Really we might be make him. we might make stupid decisions. Well, uh, I'll say this: if if you haven't been able to do a ride along, well, if you haven't even done an initial ride along with them for a week, then just let us know and we'll, we'll address the situation. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So I would try to. I would. Uh, if, what I would say to do is go into the uh, employee portal and in the training discussion, uh, tag the people who haven't done ride alongs yet. Because they've got to get in, you know, Peter, he's going to need at least three. Whether he rides with somebody else that's certified and then gets a final with you, he's got to get the three in. Because okay. um, he hasn't he hasn't actually gone through the training. He's already been towing, but he hasn't done the training. Right. And then... Strawberry needs to finish his out and whoever else, you know, so... Yeah. Uh, Barry will be the one. Strawberry needs two more. Peter Cedar needs three. Victor's... <laughs> I'm about to do his final. Once, you're, do, uh, you're, you're doing a full week's work, right, Bob? Yeah. I okay. would say once Victor gets back from vacation, then uh, you can do like a but, final with him and we'll see, and certify him. Because he's done a lot yeah, with you, so that's little, probably good. Do a little brush up with him, make sure he hasn't forgot his touch. There you go, yeah. I like the way you're thinking. And then uh, try and work on old Joe Yo, McDonald's Jeremy, with that like, appreciate it. Yo! Archie coming in with that share well, and that like. Done, Yo, make sure you smash that, that like button if you're just joining us. We're looking for that 30 you in 30 uh, chat. Ernie here, and Ernie will get, send you a, a certificate to uh, give to them. Exactly. Yes, sir. Of, of completion. Ah, uh, yeah. Then there'll be a full blown age to uh, slowing. Buddy's gonna need to do at least a final. He was already towing, but he needs to do at least a final to make sure he's doing it the hobo way, like the oh, HTT yeah. way. So I would say just, you can ride along with him and just make sure you sign off on him and he'll get his hurt too. That yeah, should be pretty easy and no brainer because he's pretty. <laughs> the only thing I have to worry about him is those damn gas pumps. Yeah, don't ride with him. Make him drop you off on the sidewalk before <laughs> going into the gas pumps. I mean, shit, you saw what happened with the gas pump and me the other day, so. Yeah, you might have to worry about me too. Yo, John yeah, coming with that follow. Welcome. Right Welcome. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Whatever. I don't want to be burnt meat. It was one time. That's it. It was just one time. Uh, yeah, I, I believe you've learned from it. Okay, where'd we go? Yeah, I mean, uh, just keep up the... Live invader. Oh, yeah, I need to go there too later. Just keep up the good work, you know? I like oh, what yeah, you're no doing. Problem. Uh... Keep an eye out for, uh, people that can help. The people that are going above and beyond, you know, things like that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's how you do it. Uh, yes, sir. Alright, you need anything from us? Mm, no, that should be it. Alright. As, yeah. as long as y'all didn't change HTT H -T -T hey, channel buddy. from 696.6, .6, then we're good. Yeah, well, I think a, a lot of them has been on eight five two point uh, seven. Yeah, uh, but, I, I have but, been, and I know Harry Nuts. Those are only two that I really recognize. 
So other yeah. than that, no one else should be because I haven't given it nobody. And well, I'm that hoping would, Harry hasn't. That was also the hobo channel. Right. And so we actually just got rid of that whole channel. So just keep everybody on the six nine six point whatever it was. Alrighty, we'll do. I think we should keep simplify everybody. that channel though too. We should think about a new one that's maybe more simple. Why that is? Mm. What is it? Six nine? What was it? Six nine six, six point nine, six, six. I think. Yeah. yeah. I mean, we get it, but everybody questions it so much. Why? Why would everybody question it? Because it is a little bit difficult. You like yeah, my new dog? Like six nine zero, but it's six 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 nine six. Oh, I, you like my new dog? She's purebred uh, Rottweiler. Hell yeah! I, I love I the don't dog. Know. Just do like nine six three point three or something like that. Give me a girl. Just come up with something easy. Right, nine, I'll get with you want to treat? Here you go. Good girl. It's a good girl. Remember, and we'll, we'll come up with something and let y'all know. Yeah. So y'all can tune in whenever y'all get on the chat or uh, get to towing. Watch out! She's a wild one. Oh shit! Gotta watch out for her. It's my guard dog. Oh shit! I don't know yet. I haven't figured it out. I'm letting her name herself. I just got her the other night. She's kind of just getting used to the things, you know? Yeah. She's All a big right, girl. Well, get out of your hair, Bo. Worry about gas you pumps and pet ready? cocks with Buddy, right? Hit that like button, everybody that comes in. Thank you. That was really fun. Yo, 15 reactions, chat. We are halfway there. Roxy. Roxy. Charney. Name her Roxy and Roxy. Charney. Hey, I'm coming with you. Let me put the uh, warehouse. Let me put that up. Put what up? Oh, okay. My, my truck. Roxanne! You don't have to put on the red light. Roxanne! You don't have to say about it to the night. Come on, girl. Come on, pretty girl. Get in the car. Come on, get in the car. Come on, get in the car, dummy. Oh, don't be mean to her like that. Come on, girl. <whistles> well, come on. Here she comes. Here she comes. Oh no, she. Oh, she's in. Good girl. I um. <laughs> I know. Here soon, I want Dolly to Parton. For warehouse Dolly. Dolly Parton. To be able to go into and you know put stuff. And... Well, yeah, but we're not even close to that yet. That's expensive. We need like at least a month. What? Maybe two Wait. weeks. Not even. You know how much money that takes for a warehouse? How much? A lot. Money yeah, we don't hey. have. What are you gonna buy it with? Your good looks? How much? Do you... We have how much money do you have? Three thousand dollars. Ain't no way. <laughs> oh, it's away. We're hobos. I don't have shit, homie. I, mean, I barely I got a pot to piss in. I got enough to put a down payment. Yeah, but then we gotta have pay pay. That's what I'm saying. We just need to think about it and probably have a meeting before we do it. Like, don't go buying a warehouse because we also need to look for the perfect spot. I don't want to just buy a warehouse because no, it's no, a warehouse. No, 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 that's what I'm saying, like, uh, I want fences. I want it. We, we need about, uh, I would say, to purchase hey, bro. it, put a down payment. Hey, bro! Balls well, yo, we what's up? Need, so I could get it easily. Don't we mean to come from a dude who kicked the dog, <laughs> right? Because I have, I'll, I'll throw 50 at that motherfucker. I don't give a fuck. I don't need money. Yeah, I mean, I'll have more money coming up, too. We just need to find something, like, fenced in that maybe has a couple more doors that we can move, like, grow into. You want to go, you want to go look real quick? I mean, we can. Where, where, you know what I was thinking? Yo, Shane, Charlotte, today coming in with that like, Cody with the like and that share, John with that like, John. 20 reactions, chat, 20 reactions. Much love, much love. Keep hitting those likes. It's away from our hobo, uh, away from our plate up here. Where are you talking? Yeah, I'm talking. Yeah, where are you talking? I'll show you. You don't think we should stay in the city? Because most of our toes are in the city. I mean, we could stay in the city, but if everybody has keys, they can wake up there, grab the truck, and come down here. 
I mean, uh, how many is the max number of spaces you can get in a garage for cars? Five. Five. Yeah, see, that's the thing, is we're only gonna fit, like... That's why, eventually, we need a place that's big enough that we can expand to at least three doors, because eventually, we're gonna need at least 15 spots. Hmm. Maybe even more. Like, we may need four doors. You know what I mean? Like, that's why I just want to buy it smart. We don't really need more than, like, maybe one bigger warehouse. Are these, are these doors operating? Eventually. I don't know, maybe. Alright, there's another warehouse. Well, you, you, it... you are the smartest person, aren't you? Oh, yeah, these are already taken. Really? You, he, Bubba didn't want to bring him here. Stay in the car. Oh, he did? Oh, shit. And then you just bring yo, him. Yo, we'll see him coming in with that like. Appreciate so that. Yo, 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 yo. Hey, oh, I get an idea, but he... Are you talking well. about my ATT employees? Oh, yes. Well, he's so dumb. I literally, we were at Legion just so he didn't know where the oh. warehouse was. I know. God, God damn it, Willie. Go back over to where our old warehouse was. This dumb fuck. Imagine if... Go back to where our old warehouse was over here. Wait, oh, what is, what's this? Oh. Hey, man, leave me alone, man. I'll fucking get over there. There's dimensions, there's dimensions, motherfucker. Ooh. Yeah, me in charge of people. And we got a mechanic shop to work on our trucks. Honestly, I should have probably huh? said something, but I... What am I supposed to say? It like, said we got a shop right here to work on our tracks. Hey, these are available. Oh, snap. I can't even go with you now. I'm getting my tow truck to come to Legion. I honestly want to buy one now so people, I mean, so people don't fucking grab it before we, before, you know what I mean? Right. You hear me? Yeah, I heard you. I mean, I don't want to rush it, but this is a fucking good spot. And it's basically fenced in. Like it's yep, sure is a property. What do you think? I mean, I think it's a good spot. How much would a small warehouse be? I think we should claim this building though, because I like it. Because nobody's gonna get one in the center, so we have the center. Center. Yeah, no one can claim it, so we'd have this whole building if we bought both sides. Yeah, but do you have 40,000? No, not yet. How much? And you really only have 40,000? Uh, yeah, I don't have anything yet. I'm not near anywhere buying one yet. Yeah, but if we claim one of them right now, we could, we could, uh, you know, focus getting our money up to claim the other one, and if someone moves in, we could, you know, try to get them to not, not, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah. So you think I should, uh, you may call and see if any DH well, around? We, 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 uh, well, because eventually, like, if we could, we if we could buy all four of these, the tow truck ops could be from there, and then over here we could have our taxis and stuff. Yeah. But we could start with one maybe. But yeah, let me call Anthony. What's the payment plan going to be though? That's the problem. Because and, and who's going to pay, pay it? You just, no, I will. You just got to pay the rest off in 21 days. Anthony. Hey, sir. Hey, can uh, I see you my location? I'm looking at this warehouse and I want to know if it's available. I mean, there's no doormat there, but I want to make sure that it's uh, Alright, I'm in the city, so it's not far. Come on, girl. Good girl. Alright. She's the perfect dog to watch out here, 40, too. 42,500 to get it going. Really? Yeah, I think we should start on this building, though. Uh, the only... No, my only... Con I mean... Over to AT, AT, what? Hey, hey, real quick, uh, Pookie, hey. since you're, uh, we, we want your, uh, Have Pookie come over here. here. Send him a ping. I'll send you, we'll send you a ping. Hey, Willie, no, you want to come here, too? Right. Yeah, Willie, you want to come look at this? Oh, yeah, send me a ping. I'm in a taxi. I took the taxi from the warehouse. Yo, chat, 23 reactions. We are seven away from the 30 and 30. We got 10 more minutes to get seven more reactions. If you haven't hit that like, bang. Thank you so much for that like. Sharks with that like. Randy, I appreciate it. Wasim, Shane, 
appreciate the likes chat welcome welcome you might have to get to back out and come back in as our area of operation because you could easily be fucking targeted from up top you at you like i wouldn't like it as to be like our hobo warehouse because you could be easily targeted from up top right well, well i mean should we ask him and then uh, maybe we shouldn't just jump right on it maybe we should like look around because maybe there is a better property but keep this as one of them i mean come on they're all four open nobody's gonna buy it right now well m maybe if, since we talked about it my our luck you know our luck someone's gonna buy it jinx it yep someone's gonna buy it you know what i mean I feel like if we don't get it, someone else will. Go back behind there. See if there's more warehouses behind the right, building. Up. Keep in mind, this is for HTT. As a possibility. Possibility. There's no warehouses back here, Ernie. Come on, girl. Oh, that's the realtor. Oh, shit. Hey, what's up? What's up, Anthony? So, uh, just cu out of curiosity. Don't worry, uh, she's friendly. These two warehouses are purchasable, right? You guys like my dogs? I would have to say no, because they technically are on a PD property. What? This ain't PD. Uh, there is a police station right there. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Well, time to look at the next spot. Be a good girl. Come on. Come on, girl. Good girl. You just don't ever jump on the first one you see, right? <laughs> you gonna be around for a while? Cause we're looking for warehouses. Um, I'm actually not. I was just getting to fly out whenever you do you have any suggestions of somewhere that would be fenced in and have a few doors you could grow into? Or somewhat enclosed? Off the top of the head, no. Um, uh -huh. If you guys are around tomorrow, I can look and find can... you guys one, but... Okay. What if, what if, what if uh... How about, how about that building over there? Because Not it's technically party. gonna be for, um... A tow truck company? Which is kind of like a city service, so maybe... Hey, we're on the way! We're almost there! Maybe we could get something worked out. Got the same one and a retriever, too. Um, Who's riding? It's mine. It's my girl! Like, I'm told by, like, if you guys go to this committee, unless I'm told by them, I don't feel okay. comfortable selling No, I feel you. I, I, That's no, fine. I, I mean, I was telling Bubba we should keep looking and not just jump on the first one we see anyway, no, no. so we can just keep looking. Oh, yeah, we'll keep looking. Yeah, guys, find something. All right, but is anybody else All in right. the 808 right now? Uh, I do not believe so. All right, well, we'll just keep looking and look around. Come on, girl. I, I, I appreciate you gonna be around tomorrow. Uh, yeah. Right. Hey, Pookie, you like my doggy? Yeah, what's his name? I haven't figured it out yet. I'm letting her name herself. I'm just, I'm letting her gain her confidence. Hey, shithead, how you doing? I mean, right now I call her dummy. Maybe that'll be her name. Call a shithead. A fuckhead. Hey, fuckhead. I was thinking about Dolly, like Dolly Parton, you know? Or. Or, uh. Yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna have to keep thinking. What the fuck is this thing? Yeah, that's my little guy right here. Come on, Shredder. Shredder? He's awfully cute. Good girl. Yeah, I got pets. I ain't get a pet. I, get ready. I, all the world's pets are my pets. Hey, he ain't a dog. I, I believe it. He's... Oh, God, I got to see that one day. Ernie's like, Ernie looks like my like, younger son or something. Ernie is? Yeah. I mean, oh, we built the same. Ernie, did you know we're both kind of built like 16th century Greek gods? I mean... <laughs> Kinda, sorta. He might as well be. Right, look at my dog. Basically. That's your dog. Oh, hey, yes, sir. Oh, hey butterfly. Dog. Hey butterfly. That's her name, dog. right? Butterfly. Yeah. Butterfly. How you doing? Butter and butterfly. Hey, how's it going, Ben? So you were you were wanting to do a run HTT? Or uh, sorry, God dang. You were wanting to run uh, the HTT up out of here? 
Yeah, but we can't. Some friends of mine, you know, just chilling. Well, we did see what you was up to. She ain't wanting to. Alright, that's cool. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm, uh, I can come by myself that's or I can bring my hobo buddies and go and talk to them too. They can tell you how good I've been doing. Well, we were just we we were just talking to the D8. All right, really? sounds good, man. Talk yeah. to you soon. Maybe. How much, how much money right, do you need? Oh uh, well, to get one warehouse to start, it's forty-two thousand. Oh shit! Let me call Astrid. Get him! Get him, girl! Get him! Attack! Good girl, yeah, good girl, yeah, this a good girl. Get him, yeah. That Get dog just attacked that rat. Oh my god. Eat shredder. Eat shredder. Come on, eat him. Eat him, good girl. That's a good girl. Come on. Come on, dummy. Good girl. She won't actually bite. She's just all about the the talk. Now, if you shoot at me, she'll bite. Hell yeah, I gotta go to burger shop later in Vegas. Twitter it won't work. Yeah, I got her to work. I just sent her back. Name her Athena, the Greek Athena. goddess. Right? <laughs> then I can say she's built like a Greek god too. Ladonna coming with that like Bobby with that like MD with that like yo bang. What's up, chat? Chat, we're four reactions away. If you haven't hit that like button yet, smash it. Smash that like button. We're almost there. We got four yeah, minutes. Well, three like, minutes to get four reactions. We got like this. We got this. We got this. 30 and 30. Hashtag 30 and 30, baby. Uh, yeah. We don't have to rush it, Bubba. It's all good. Where'd you go, Bubba? I say we look around and stuff, and worst case scenario, we call somebody tomorrow or the next day. Like, if, I mean, already if we buy one right now, anyways, it's gonna stretch everyone's funds for it. Like, hey, we got a meeting with the chief of police about purchasing this property. Ah, oh, what the hell? About purchasing this property? Yeah. So how much is it? You guys want to at least have a meeting and get uh, at least having an option? Is he coming this way? Uh, yeah, no, no, why not? No, we go, we're going to go talk to him. But yeah, if, I'm down. If it's an option, it's just an option we can add to our book. If it's not an option, then fuck it. We're not we're not going to buy it today. We're just yeah. trying to see if we can get it as an option. Listen, okay. Bubba, just because yeah. my vape smells like Fruity Pebbles doesn't mean you can eat it, okay? Well, it's not your asshole, so I'm not going to eat it. All right, boys, let's go. We heading? Where are we going? Good girl. Come on, let's go. I'm getting the car. Yeah, BPD. Okay. Come on, girl. I get my tow truck from the, the impound. All right, then. Oh, you... Oh. You killed my dog, Pookie. Hey, imagine, imagine imagine to let it, hey dogs, you're leaving our dogs, homie. Oh, shit. If they let Pookie it, just ran over my dog. dog. This dog is fine. It's go back and get my dog. Time, I, I no, I'm just putting down mine to go home. Bounce his head off my bumper up so slightly. Go get my go poor home. dog. Just tell him to go home. You can't go back and get your dog or what? He oh home. my god! <laughs> oh, oh, you killed her! Oh, the humanity! Oh, oh tell her to go home! Go home! Come on, get in the car, stupid! Good girl! You get my tow truck, man. Oh, you motherfucker! <laughs> what? She's in. No. Sh oh, okay. Motherfucker. <laughs> Dude, if we could buy, if we could get this, this would be. Fucking Not in my eyes, chat. Where's Buddy? I don't know where Buddy is. Literally called the hobo. Go talk that smart. Brian, coming in with that like, right? Exactly. That would be a good spot to have right there, close to the really city. It's, it's close, to, yeah, it's real close to the city, real close but I, to the But I still yard. think, I think we should talk to him about permission, but I still yeah. think we should also keep looking, just... I, I 
agree. I agree. We're not gonna just like buy me. I mean, I kind of wanted to, but let's slow down. Let's have this meeting. Let's see what he says. And a BPD. What the and fuck, then, man? Uh, we'll it's just go from there. Exactly. And if we can get the option, no well then, it's an option, you know. Oh option, shit. Well, then, oh shit. Well, oh shit. Oh shit. He done that back. shit on purpose. Better beat his ass. He killed my dog. But he went to sleep early tonight. Oh damn. Sharks laughing. Yeah, tow job. That's awesome spot. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you just gotta RP it out, man. You gotta run into us naturally and not force it. And if you find us and stuff, like, you know, we're always posting that we're hiring. So. Is that Gary? Gary! Is that you? Hey, tell your dog to go home. No, she wants to go into PD. Alright, well, as long as she's not aggressive. Come on, baby! Wait, does this payphone work? Oh, I wish. You're really being... You're really being a bitch tonight, you know that? All right, go home. Go home. Uh, I'm probably a little underdressed for this. It's okay. Yeah, I mean, no sense in like you know, changing who we are, right? Let's be real. We're real. Yeah, yeah. All right, pulling up. All right, then we're in the lobby. Pulling out is safer. How you doing, sir? It's going great. How are you? Is this Pookie? Uh, no. Uh, you sound familiar. Who are you? Me, I'm Bubba. Bubba, what up, man? We're gonna get back to your service, sir. I love you. You remember my badge? He did not steal your badge. He stole not this badge, but a similar badge. You sure it wasn't that badge? I'm positive it's not this badge. I love you, though. Hey, can you get? He doesn't uh, love anyone. Astrid down here. Don't let him lie to you. Uh, no, man. Uh, how's fuckers truckers? I uh, don't have fuckers truckers. We don't own fuckers truckers. We were branded. Nah. Yeah, we actually yeah. rebranded to hobos towing a taxi, but we go for HTT is short because it's not all hobos. Oh. Okay. All right. Uh, yeah. Love you. We have a meeting with uh. Yeah. Astrid. Okay. Do you uh, need any it, questions for us, important? detective? It's very important, sir. Uh, I'll have questions for you guys later. Wait, you for real? For real, yeah. Don't worry about it. Wait. Yeah, what do you have questions about? Wait, is that Gary? Gary, is that you? Or is that Billy? How can we help you? What was your name again? I'm Detective Oakley. Oh, okay. I've talked to two out of three. I've talked to this guy and I've talked to Bubba. Gary, I haven't talked you, to you. You talked to me? Oh, what do you need to talk to me for? What's your name, by the way? Oh, okay. My name later. is Job. Okay. All right. Uh, Where is she? Yeah, we can do that later. Me? Am I important enough? Nope. Dude, we talked. We have interrogated you before, man. We talked. Yeah. And, what, and is that, what, what does Oakley was want to talk to us about? Crack? Was that before he revitalized his life and stopped doing crack? Entire time for bed. Have fun, man. Hell yeah, man. Have a good night. Evan, come in with that like. Yo, Jack, 28 reactions. We didn't make it. We didn't make it. But we're one away. One away. Yo, what's up, Evan? How's it going, homie? You guys want to come outside? No, he wants you to come in here. I'm not here for that. I'm here for the police. Go for Gary. No, but are you for real to keep a police? Yeah, he's yes. for real the chief of police, okay. actually. Wait, Don't I shoot have, us. I have a question. We come in peace. Hello, Ernie. Oh, hi, How cutie. Are you? Die question. Hi, how's it going? So, we are running a business called HTT. I'm doing great, thank you for Hobos, asking. towing, and taxi. Oh, another one. Okay. Well, we've been That's running That's your felon. It. How the fuck are you running a business? Well, we've been They're running independent it for... contractors. We're independent contractors. Independent contractors. All the own the business, Chief. Yep. They've told yeah, me this right. several times. It's a, share, so we, we... it's a shareholder business. It, basically, it's 
you know, it's hard out there for that single guy. So instead of being that single guy, we employ the people that are wanting to tell that have a hard time getting it out on their own, and we help employ them under the name that's yeah, recognizable and known. And we, we give them a second chance, is what we do. We're actually working on a reform program with Pookie first, and everything, where yeah. we're going to take on parolees and let them work for us and become reformed. Are you Pookie? Yeah, that's the reason we're yeah, not here for now. Yeah, that's me. Uh, you got a lot of swagger. I'm just going to put that out there. Hey man, you know I try. I do you do, do what I can. You are what I motherfucking do. succeeding, brother. Why does he have his gun out? Thank you, man. He's Probably because we've murdered uh, I've been really, ever since I figured somebody out that smoking crack and brain damage are two things that shouldn't go together. You know everything's been great. You know so as long as I stay off the crack, with one long comes as, the other, I guess. Yeah. Exactly. See. And as long as I stay off the crack, you know. It's all good I'm as long as he stays off the crack, chat. Yo, Stephanie, coming in with that night. Fifty-five days of following. The reason why we're the reason why we're here, sir, is we are looking for a place to uh, run the HTT out of. We're looking for, you know, I mean, like a um, a business place. We're looking to expand. I have a question. Do you guys literally camp next to Benny's over there? Nope. In the middle of the street. Mm, no, we don't know who guys? that is. We don't know who No, that's not a. No. No, you get okay. Because I no, we allegedly just... almost killed them every time I'm in a chase. Yeah, we don't know. Yeah, no. Yeah, no, yeah, no we, uh, we focus on being busy keeping the area around yeah. PD and the streets clean from okay. cars. Okay. So we found a spot. We found this nice parking lot. But it's the beautiful. Is, I, I, yeah, it's amazing. It's got, it's got a place where we could work on our trucks. It's got a lift in there already. That's, and it's got some warehouses that we could use uh, to, for our, our stuff. But the, the thing is... Um, D8 showed up and they said, well, I'm not sure yet because it's on a, a rundown PD's property. Oh, hey, hey, yo. And what so my question about? is, this place at? um, it's actually it's on capital and pop capital and popular. Oh, Mesa. That blue ass looking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 Never offered yes, but I'm listening both. to the hobos and I'm so really stressed. So is it right next to that? Dog. Is it adjacent to that, or is it it's, like it's, that it's, place specifically? Well, it's right next to it. It's like yeah, behind it's it. Right it's right all connected. like it's, it's concrete it's walls connected. that are behind it. Well, I mean, do you, can we go over there? You want to go over there and meet us? You can see it. It's right around the corner. It's not very far. Yeah. Gary, what do you think? Yeah, Gary, can you guys go over there so we can show you? Yeah, come on, Gary. I, I won't tell him that you knocked me out. I mean, okay, we allegedly, the other night. Uh, we don't leave the car and we take the bear cat. That's fine. That's fine. What, whatever whatever y'all need to do. Do you want me to fly overhead too, Gary? Yeah, do you want Air One to support you? Yeah, we're going to need Air One back. All right. Yeah, so, make sure right. you bring your heat units. Should be enough on this baby do you guys want to follow us or do you want me to put it on your GPS? We always follow, we'll follow you. you. Okay, All right. let's, let's get, a, let's get a, a, a train going. Yeah, let's do a train. Yeah, let's run Wait. a train. Choo -choo. Yeah, that. Oh, that. Not that kind of train, my bad. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, like a convoy, right, just, not a train. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I mean, if we were a gangbang tank number three on the south side, then, uh, you know, the it'd be possible. But... Gates, okay? All right, sounds good. Second. All right, Sam, All right thanks, sir. Hell yeah. I really hope he, they, he approves this. Oh. Oh, no. Guys, I have no idea what's happening. Just follow, just follow and see. Following We're having the chief of police follow us to that property to see if he'll let us buy it instead of the government, instead of PD keeping it. Should I put my mess up? Uh, probably. Or just don't pull it out. Unlike your sex life, definitely pull it out. Darlene's fertile as fuck. Anybody know where Mike went? Saying I was never notified when I've been for 55 days. Now I just, I did just get out of 30 days. Basically. Oh, damn it. Well, welcome back. Welcome back. <laughs> Yo, Jim. Jim coming in with 100 stars. Yo, appreciate that star bomb. Bombing. Appreciate that star bomb. Yo, 30 reactions. Smash it. 31 reactions, chat. 31 reactions. See, now he's gonna say yes, and then you're just gonna want it, and not even wanna think about it any further. You're gonna be like, I want, I want, I want, give it to me. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're gonna talk about it. Obviously. You don't mind just telling them when we're out front. I'm out front. Ooh, BCD, hey, right? maybe. Hey, I got an idea. Should we tell them when we get there that the real reason why we brought I'm gonna pitch. 
I'm gonna pitch the idea that we're gonna be willing to hire on parolees as part of their, like, parolee work leave and see if PD will sign on to the program and be willing to donate one of the warehouses. You should pitch that. Now, listen, when we get there, or half of the warehouse. When we get there, we gotta tell everyone else to shut the fuck up except for you. Uh, we're in the back of the CPD. We're just waiting for them. I mean, you tell them. <laughs> Alright, when we get there, Ernie's gonna do the business pitch. Everyone else, shut the fuck up. <laughs> yeah, especially you, Bubba. I ain't nah! gonna fucking work. <laughs> I knew that was coming. I probably will talk. <laughs> no, but we do have a great idea. We're going to try to yeah, get both well, of them. No, let's not say we. You have a great idea. Okay, I have a great idea. I'm full of them, but I didn't want to do I'm humble, too. I think yeah, we could... What's his idea? We, if we anything, we could get him to pay for half of it. 40000 Our initial down payment? Yeah, so we could get both. Well, let's first, let's just see if we can get permission. Well, yeah, first, we'll talk about permission, and then, after he gets permission, I'll be like, okay, and then that comes into our plan here at HCT and what we would like to involve hey, PD in on reforming criminals. Have we'll have an open door policy, like they could go in there anytime Hey, guys, want. there's like, there's like a six car oh, yeah. up at VPD. They seriously got out the riot van? What do you think we're gonna do, murder him? No, I think they just like driving around in it. Wait, 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 wait. We gotta pull up out front. Pick up Ashford. Alright, alright. Here, pull up beside him so I can tell him we're not gonna pull kill him. Up around front. Cause they gotta pick <laughs> somebody up. They're picking up Astrid. Astrid Dangle. Hey, you pull up beside and tell him we're what picking up Astrid. Tell oh, Astrid oh, to get in our car. God. Astrid! Do we need do we need to get some HD? Over here? here, let's try to get Astrid to ride with us. Hurry up, go over there and try to get Astrid to ride Actually, with us. I think I, I think I might Wheelie. get out of here. Wheelie. Yeah. I'm gonna go get Astrid. What's up, man? Should we get some uh, HTT employees over here to tow this? Yeah, there's like a six car pileup, man. Y'all, y'all come on over here. Six cars, man, all flipped over on top of my car at well, Someone call Bo and tell him to get to get, get people over here. All right. I would, but I don't know where my tow truck is. It's gone. You keep really me know. I am in a better mood. Now. Yeah, I figured it might be interesting for you. Yeah, I'm in a great mood. Thank you guys so much. No problem. Yeah, miss, your detectives are out here doing work. Are you ready to go? I am ready. So sorry. Okay. We got a oh, seat so for many you. Fucking cars here. Uh, we got towers coming to tow them right now. Oh, it's like a ball pit of cars. We've got our employees coming to tow these right now. Here, Astrid, you get shotgun in the SUV. I call Bo. He's Ow! Bring uh, maybe you don't want to ride in that. So Ooh, I want to ride. Uh, Gary. How do I get uh, on the uh, side? We got, some of a, we got some truck tow trucks coming to get some clear this area out for you. Sounds good. How do I get out of this? In, on this, I went on the side. Damn, man. You get on the like eight, nine, ten, or eleven feet. I don't even know where they came from. I'll just sit there about to get right. I'm man, trying to get through this. Alright, I'm ready. Alright. The top one's like 11, 12, 13, 14. I'm not sure. Alright, Bubba, I'm gonna ride on the side of this swap vehicle and make sure that they stay safe. Alright, yeah. There you go, Gary. That's what I'm saying. Hey, uh, Willie, did you get a hold of Bo? Yeah, Bo, hey, Bo's in route, yeah. Don't but think you, so, Chief. Even when I was in Facebook jail, I was still here. <laughs> Wondering where you been. In order to get access to that seat. You ping? All right, big fella. Whenever you're ready, we can dip. All right. I guess I'll go time, boy. I'm the move. All right, don't drive too crazy, because I'm on the side of this, Bubba. <laughs> Chief. What? <laughs> Nothing at all. Nothing happened. Don't worry about it. I don't see anything. I don't know what you're talking about. That's good. That's good. Ow! <laughs> Ow! That's just uh -oh. my fingers. I'm good. Okay. okay. Yep. Yeah, you just don't wave your hand around like that. Yeah. 
Something tells me he's going to try to knock me off the side of this vehicle chat. <laughs> <laughs> had huge adverts and never kept going up on my end. It was like 200 people watching at one time. Hell yeah. So who's going to be the owner of said business? Well, you see, that's the thing is at HTT currently we, uh, we're kind of like employee owned. So basically everybody has a little bit of stake in the company. So it encourages everybody to be, provide top notch professional toes because you know, it's their name and reputation. Can they do that, Ashwin? Is that like a legal loophole? I'm sorry, is what illegal? Owning a business? It's no, but I, they have legal ones it. with them. They'll just have to put it in the legal one's name, realistically. But I, I don't think that they can get around them having felonies. They'll have to expunge someone or... Arlene will have to own it. If Darlene's not a felon, I don't know. Oh, she's... She's, <laughs> she's a big fan of Darlene myself. She's worse than me. She's the worst. See, we aren't, we haven't decided if we're going to go fully official or just keep like basically being a bunch of subcontractors, you know, focusing on keeping the streets clean, mm. you know. Oh, yeah, I'm good. Oh. I had no idea this was here. Me neither. Really? That's a big place. Big place, big place. Yeah. It's a great place. We got a place in there where we can work on our truck. You see, HTT is more is going to be more than just towing. It's going to be a taxi service. And our plan is to eventually have standard taxis. Then we plan on running SUVs like an Elite series. And then we plan on even going as far as a limousine series and possibly an air series. But right now we're just in the beginning stages and this is like the perfect spot. And if nobody ever bought that, we could expand over there as we continued the fleet. You know? There's so many thoughts on the horizon. Do you guys have other options in mind? Because not going to lie, this is definitely part of the police department behind us here. Uh, what about what about that 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 one over there? Yeah, that, that too. Okay. I don't I don't see it being used in the foreseeable future. Yeah. But I know I know troopers were inquiring about getting this place open. Hey, what's wrong with your truck that night, bro? From days. If that's oh. gonna happen or not, but I would hate to have to kick us out. Guys Claim the imminent domain. Yeah. Domain. Yeah. In case it ever happens, um, do you have any other options in mind? Uh, we could keep looking. This was just yeah. kind of the first one. We just thought we'd get some, you know, thoughts on it. You know. Yeah, I think I think the idea was is uh, that we would kind of have an open door policy with the police and kind of uh, work with them if we were able to work out of here and it would only be used for, you know, city services of. Um, towing and uh, taxi for the business um, and you know you guys would be able to come and go um, and you know we, we wouldn't be hiding anything this is completely all you know over the board type stuff we're trying to be legit you know yeah and even if like even without like becoming like fully certified like I mean we plan on hiring felons but it's fully legal work inside HTT like we, like we plan on like reforming and helping, you know, we even were thinking about possibly working with, you know, DOC and like if there's people coming out on parole, you know, then they could potentially come work for us on like a work release, you know, for a while, very, you know, very noble. Yeah. help them well, rehabilitate. Hypothetically, you'd get this place, what, what kind of changes would you like to do to it or like alterations or like? Ah, uh, well, I mean. If any. Really, we weren't thinking any, like, major outside renovations, per se. I mean, a gate would yeah, be cool, but so. really, we were just thinking just, you yeah, know, just really a gate. standard yeah. warehouse, you know, in... And we were thinking, we think we might need four eventually, because, you know, you're limited to, you know, five vehicles inside the warehouse, you know, that's about all these ones will fit, you know, so... We may need eventually as we grow more, but we thought we could start with these two, and then we got the... You know, obviously that center one's open, so we can use that as our, uh, you know, little repair shop for our vehicles. Our mechanic bay. 
you know? It just huh. seemed like a good spot, you know? Hmm. Yeah, it's not, it's, I mean, there's not a lot of gangers over here, you know what I mean? So what um, if... Chill area. Yeah. What if we were to do, if it were to be possible, what if we just had, like, a clause where we understood if imminent domain took over that, you know, maybe the police department could just buy them back for cost and we'd just move down the road or something, you know? Give us, give us like, a 15 to 30 yeah. day notice. Or even, like, a five-day notice, you know? Yeah. We'll try not to decorate them too much so we don't earn too much. Yeah, that's, like, genuinely, I'm not trying to be a dickhole or anything, but I, I know for a damn fact that troopers keep mentioning this place I and okay kind of open up doors here for them yeah but at the same time to troopers are to okay, pretty we're ass coming. so i don't know if that's ever going to happen <laughs> i would i would <laughs> hate to have to you know have to eat you guys out of here because yeah. the department's opening up uh, yeah i mean we could I mean, if we could keep looking tonight and then like you can think about it more and then, like I said, worst case scenario, if Take it a became a possibility... So you can find some, you know, I guess yeah, we'll definitely... Yeah. We'll definitely yeah. look. I think one of the big problems... Hold on, I'm getting pulled over. My bad, I didn't mean yeah, to Yeah, we could... No, you're good, you're good. Give it a dare to say two one more. Of... Oh. Hold on, I'm getting pulled over <laughs> one second. <laughs> I'm so bad. How are you? I was just gonna say, I think one of the big problems is a lot of the good spots for warehouses are uh, already taken, especially ones that have, um, you know, certain aspects like this does, you know, the walls the gated, and stuff the like that. Gated, yeah. And underneath the bridge, you know, us hobos, we always feel most comfortable underneath the bridge. So, yeah, I mean, this this brought us back to being home, you know. But yeah, sorry for, uh, sorry for interrupting you, Chief. Yeah, he's honestly never been the same since he lost Tortellini. Uh, I still think take a day or two more. Yeah. See if you can scout a bear spot. If not, we can we can talk about it. As long okay. as you guys agree to, you know, having to move house in case they do decide to open up. Yeah. Yeah, we're, we're fine. Be like, hey, tomorrow you gotta move out, obviously. So don't worry hey, about that. Hey, can I ask you a question? A yeah, yeah, that yeah. That's fine. That's that would be awesome. Um, why does uh why do people keep on bringing up my anal swab that Gary did? Uh, divine people. people, you mean? Like, I don't know. The pe I, like, <laughs> lawyers and anybody that looks at my file, they're always like, You got an anally swab? Whoa, please tell me that's not like documented, recorded there. Please tell me it's not like. And then I have to tell the story about like <laughs> how he not only did it, but he like. Smelled Yo, chat of your. Uh, uh, and made weird swab noises. Anally. Seven, you eight, aware eight, of that? 22. Uh, the smelling of the fingers. Does it really I'm say that on the report? No, yeah, you want to talk on that? You want to? I'm jealous because Gary's never smelled his finger after me. I like to be very uh, specific and detailed in my reports. So, of course, we report how I swapped. Chat. Oh my God. Was it hit by his choice? Sorry, I'm gonna eat real quick. Yeah, but chat. It wasn't. It's all. It wasn't yeah. even in like a medical oh. facility. It was in the lobby of MRPD. Hey, but you know, you requested it. So, so is, I'm not. I'm not like saying I did. Here's a question. That's a local. Uh, that's not local. If troopers are gonna be here and VPD exists, what if we uh, opened a tow lot out at the old MRPD building? Okay, that is definitely no. Oh, I mean, okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> I think you're pushing it now. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that place still has oh a lot God. of PD shit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right. I'm, yeah ben, I'm you, sure. you would be proud of Pookie right now, Ben. Oh, ben. hey, Ben. That's Ben's lawyer. That's my lawyer. I hey, Ben. Told you guys, he might be showing up. What's up, Ben? But yeah, our yeah, plan ultimately... Yeah. Really, where are you? So we were no, just, uh, where Bubba is now. Yeah. just talking to the chief about Where's possibly that? using this uh, area a as a headquarters yeah. or our hub for yeah, HTT. I'm trying to find that out, too. You know, Hold on. That I'm going to see you paying a bullet up there, okay? Yeah. Okay. What's your thoughts on it, chief? My thoughts on it are it's a police building property, and uh, troopers might want to open doors here. They've been talking about it a lot for, like, uh, months. <clears throat> We offered to sign a uh, imminent domain clause yeah. that 
should that ever happen, they can purchase it at cost and take it back over. Did you guys get a quote on the, the price at least from DA? Or? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It would just be <laughs> regular. Be like no, 85000 for a small warehouse, warehouse I think, or yeah. something like that. Now, Hello. we did have an idea. It's kind of like a partnership with uh, PD or maybe PD and DOC. Like, if we were to... Because we were thinking about using this as, like, for reformed criminals to work for us as an option. So, y'all could rely on us. Uh, would PD be interested in making a contribution to one of the warehouse purchases? It, big or small, it doesn't matter. We just wanted to know if you wanted to help as, like, a, you know... Bringing in for, uh, the good name. Leader of the public affairs department. To be honest. <laughs> what was the question? Sorry. Oh you my make a God! To the you're willing to stick to eight the fingers warehouse? up his bum hole, but you're not able to listen. Uh, yeah. To uh, how much are we talking? And oh, wait, are we using our funds? No, 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 no. Or no, are you no. asking me personally? I mean, you know. I just spent like 200 grand on What is Club going Plus. on over here? You know, $20 is $20, Gary. You need $20 to open up a Arlene. Actually, Take we that. need like $85,000, but, you know, $20 hey, is still $20. Arlene's my hey, favorite chief. Hey, we are definitely working on the money situation, okay? Uh, just a couple we'll weeks ago, I was uh, over $100,000 in debt, I'll let you know. And uh, Yo. now... I'm not not only uh, uh, out of debt, I was able to buy my own tow truck company and turn my life around with the help of HCT, and that's the truth. So he's already a living example. And I mean, Willie and I both spent 450 long ass months in prison, and we got out and we both own tow trucks now as well. And we've hired several employees as well lately. And we have a full training program with a head trainer. We have an HR department. Oh, Everything is looking HR. up. Who's HR for the HTT? Well, we're still working on hiring for it. The department is created. <laughs> oh, you have the... Okay. Well, wait, I'm, yeah. a, I'm HR until we get more. And we got a we couple others. An, like, basically the employee, founders. Yeah, we have an employee portal where, the you know, any complaints... Yep. Uh, are, are logged and sent directly to the top uh, for now, that which is mainly Ernie. We have... And he's been, uh, you know, in charge of operations and, and whatnot. We have a strict training program that actually, like, teaches our drivers to go above and beyond for every client, so it, every tow is a successful tow. Uh, we have an automated text line that texts customers asking them to do a review after we've serviced them. It waits about 15 minutes and sends them a text message that's automated. Oh, yeah. It does give them the option to reply stop until the next time we tow for them. So, it's it's pretty great, yeah. Let me ask you this. Would you guys think that um, PD tows would be your main business? Well, future. that's that's what we've been going for. Would honestly. we consider it as our main business? I mean, yeah, main source of income. I mean, yeah. If, if we were yeah. hired to do that, yeah. Because I was thinking, there's alternatives that we can look into, such as uh, you guys renting out this place, for mm. PD, mm -hmm. and we can do some like you know free tows for PD. Sure. But oh, I, the, I like that idea. Main source of income. I don't know if that's advantageous for you. But I mean, it's not our main source. We still, you know, we're talking for the local, uh, um, the civilian the, like, like the, well, the civilian yeah. populace, but also the local, the local, uh, um, yeah, we mechanic shops and stuff like that, too. We and also we tow for any abandoned capacity. vehicles. If you really want me to be honest with you, when we tow, our motto is hey, listen, this is a free tow. And if you want to tip, you can tip if you choose to. But if not, it's free. That's what we do. Well, yeah. Tip. 100%. It's kind of. Yeah, I'm, I'm just. I'm just saying because you were like, oh, I wonder if this is your main source of income. Honestly, we don't even get income off this. I've been paid for a lot. Of people. The only we, thing we, we charge for free. now. The only thing we charge for now is three hundred fifty dollars for the repair kit because the repair kit costs that. If they don't give that, yeah. then we're out. But then we, you know, it's a tip if they want to. So. I think. I think that if we were able to make a deal like this, okay. Um, it would be very good for both parties and not only that it would uh, give us a chance to prove ourselves that we could actually uh take over or uh compete uh against uh nadia's tow jobs for the
contract that PD has. You know, long term, of course. Oh. That's they don't that's have not what. Yeah, but uh, yeah, yeah. They, just, don't? they don't. They don't have. Yeah. Really? Oh, okay. Mm -mm. I I thought we. I yeah, thought we're they not. Did. We're not too big on exclusivity. Oh, that's, yeah. that's good. That's good to hear. PD. Yeah, that's good. See, but and we're, that's we're not, and and we're not worried about and that's the thing is, and, and I'll just be the first person to say, like, we aren't necessarily looking for that inclusive or whatever that big mighty word you just used. Yeah, no, like we, we don't were want that. we were never looking for that. In fact, we no. welcome other companies to operate. We're just trying to build another reputable side for the people that might want to work for somebody else. You know what I mean? Like, we're just trying. You know, we. We're trying to build yeah, a company it, as well. There, there's nothing yeah, wrong think, with healthy competition. There's more than one place to eat in town. You know what I mean? Yeah, my like, thought process let, wasn't let talk, was, my talk. thought process wasn't as much about taking over all the torture. It was more or less I, I I feel like that's what was happening to us. And if if we were just able to prove ourselves that we would get more business, yeah, that's kind of what we're looking and for. And I and I don't think it's that we were trying to take over any contract no. either. Like, we've just always been under this impression that based on what we've been told and, and everything that's happened that we don't have to hash out, but we've been told that there was a contract and it's not that we want to take that from somebody. We just want the right to, I mean, if we're available and they're not, then why couldn't we tell, you know, if, if yeah. but they're available right? and we're not, that's, like, it's, it's all about the free business. You know, stuff neither here nor there. That's yeah. not, we're just know, here I mean, to service not, what needs to happen. We don't need to dip our toes in there. Be down for maybe like I mean, day. if I'm being down. if a couple of days pass and you're really like decided on this place specifically, yeah, it, it would be much easier for us to to rent it out to you guys. I like that idea. Yeah, yeah that's a good idea. I mean, I are... mean at, that, at that point, at that point, like, you know, what I mean, like. If we do need a move, you can give us the move. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, if troopers ever decide to actually open up, it would make the whole process of helping you guys move out much easier. Sure, understand. Yeah, understand. that sounds good. That sounds good. So how would uh, how would the rental work? Do you or would we come up with that later on? I mean, we we can sit down later down the line and just figure out a balanced fair amount. Okay. Like weekly payments or. We are currently. We are currently working on expanding our daytime hours, so, um, it's just a matter of hiring and stuff. Like, a lot of our operations are evening to late night, but we've got some daytime as well that have been pretty active, so we're, we're just working on growing. So, but when, when we're in here, we actually have been doing a lot of PD toes for the last, like, week now. Um, PD's been calling us, like, multiple times. We've done easily, like, eight to... 10 a day, maybe, so. Yeah. Um. Daytime and nighttime. Yellow pages? Oh, yeah. That's yep. at least me personally, and I know a lot of cops do the same. We don't really have time to find specific towers or whatever. We usually just pop open yellow pages and whoever's first gets the, the job, you know? Yeah. Okay, hell yeah. As long as you guys uh, keep a... Uh, an active presence in yellow pages, you should have no issues in getting PD toes, and there's tons of them constantly around the clock. Sure, yeah. Sure. I mean, um, if I guess, um, let a couple of days pass. If you guys don't find a bare place that's uh, more suitable for you or to your liking, I said they'd rather rent it, right? This one, um, make up like a um, business proposal. A lease, not necessarily well, agreement. Uh, yeah, just, just a, a lease agreement that you would need facility-wise over here. Like okay. okay. Warehouses exactly, locations, uh, office space. If you guys need one, just so uh, we know what the garage space. Is. I yeah. would okay. say. I mean, I would say if we were renting it, then. Yeah, I can write that. Up. Think big, okay. I can write that up, but I would I would say if we were rent I would say if we were renting it, then we would want all four of these warehouses. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Instead of small All right, Arnie. Well, I, 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 that has the limit. Yeah, like I mean, I personally, if we're proposal, nothing set in stone. So sure, sure, sure. Pressure. Yeah, we'll get that written up, and I'll get some photos and write it up. I mean, I think, yeah, that works. But yeah, well, I appreciate the conversation really a lot. I mean, no, you guys are good. I know Astrid uh, fucks with you guys, so. I beat yeah, him yeah, up yeah, all the time. Yeah, you mean, Except for you Ernie. Mean, I think I don't yeah, beat up Ernie. Everybody else. Gary beat my ass. Darlene is, 
is mm -hmm. I'm a big fan of Darlene. I don't even try to fight Ashley because I know she's Yeah, we're best friends. Yeah. yeah. There's no point. Well, this is gonna be my maid of honor my next one. Big time, big time. Oh, now, yeah. now, just to be clear. Hello? Now, just to be clear on this virtual situation, we do hire felons, and several of us do have felonies. But, again, like Pookie said, we would have, especially with renting it, we could have a full open door policy where you guys can have a key and come on in as much as you want, because it is up and up. Yeah, it's 100% legal through these operations, like. We're all about reforming people and helping, so... Like, yeah, it would be an open-door policy, but... Just know there's people that have pasts. I mean, that... That doesn't make you any more different than any other business in, in the city. Besides True. the PD, to be honest, so... Yeah, yeah. You good. You don't need to worry about that. As long as, you know... felonious stuff doesn't affect your work, especially when it comes to dealing with cops... That shouldn't be an issue. And that's Hell basically yeah. the plan and and stuff like yeah exactly like make a living, you know? yeah, yeah exactly and that's where we you know again as we felons, because you know. we hire felons our employees may make mistakes on their own accord outside of the company but we definitely have a corrective action plan also in place already with hr that Things like that don't, there's zero tolerances and stuff. So we have a couple of things that it's like one right up and then the next one you're out the door. So it's, All right, fair we're fair very fair. serious. So, but as long as they don't make a mistake on the clock, it's none of my business what they do outside of it, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah HCT, same traffic on that. HTK keeps me busy, you know what I mean? It's, uh, I'm all going on my third week of parole. It's off the track. I haven't had any issues, no running with the police. And Chat, they're going to rent it to us? That is so of, cool of, of if they would do that. Honestly. We're basically telling them, hey, we're still going to be criminals. Yeah, That's good. But good not in it's this business. Ar Arnie will get that over. Um, do you want us to send it to you or Astrid in the emails? With the Either works. Doesn't really matter. Okay. I got, I got Astrid's emails. So. We'll get him. Both of us. Okay. Well, I tell you what we do. I'll, yeah, I'll have Bubba create an email thread and I'll send it to the thread. He knows our, both of our emails. Should yep. Be an issue. Who does? <clears throat> ben. You guys his lawyer. Oh, Ben. Yeah, Ben. Yeah. We'll get it to you both. Uh, we'll send it to you. Let me also give you my contact info. Well, well that way, if you need anything, because I've been contracts and stuff like that. Financially, like Bubba's gonna help a lot of this, but um. Yeah. Yeah, let's get a lot of the operations I'm in charge of, so. If we're going to write up a contract, uh, then ben, we can have Ben write it up. You know what I mean? I'm sorry, your name was? Uh, Ernie Gimp. Ernie? Yes, sir. All right. That's a solid photo. That was when I looked good. That was before I went downhill. Jesus. Arnie, do you Gary, you buddy? shut the fuck up. What? I love you. Ernie. <laughs> I heard you snicker. What? I said we can have Ben write up the con uh, li like write up the lease agreement and stuff like that. Perfect. Yeah. I mean, I would say if we're going that go route. Ernie. That's me. And what was your name again, Chief? I just know you by Chief. Dex Bishop. Fuck. Fuck what? What guy? <clears throat> Nothing. I actually declined it. Wow. That wasn't his. Yeah, perfect. So we will, um, uh, we'll work on that, the, we'll work on the logistics of the contract with our lawyer, Ben, and then, uh, I'll work on the proposal of what we would need with the lease agreement, and, Yeah, um, just be, like, logistically wise, what exactly you guys would need here, like, where would you need a, a warehouse entrance, where would you need a garage? Yeah. If you need an office space, where exactly? And, I mean, um, if, Yeah, if, you pretty much need to stick to either this or that right structure back there or both of them both, yeah. to be both honest i would say if we were going to go the lease route i would say we would put we would take four warehouses on all of these four doors and then keep that one obviously because that's the mechanic bay and then okay. we could design well, the warehouse we gotta, we gotta, into an office we got to see if we can get those open because i don't know if we can get those open because those are not the same doors as this one. Oh yeah it's true yeah, I mean, uh, well, I mean they should uh, still be able to construct them. No. 
No. No, we'll, no, we'll just use this one that they got right here. As long as there's no doormats over there, which it he said it was locked up and there was nobody that rents it currently, they should be able to open them up yeah, and but... bring the construction crew in to build them out. Yeah, well... Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah we'll... As for actual, you know, unlocking hey, gates, yeah. I don't know about that specifically, but definitely can the warehouse can be yeah. constructed in there. I don't think that we... That building is off limits, though. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I think we could just do uh, some warehouses and then maybe on maybe a small office space on one of the doors and everything. And that would, if we did four warehouses, that'd give 20 parking spots and that would give us enough to run a fleet of 10 tow trucks and then a handful of taxis and then eventually SUVs and things like that. So that would help us get the. Because I think, I mean, right now. Our goal is no, no, no. to our goal is to have ten trucks, but as long as because right now they're owned individually and then they'll stay that way. But without a warehouse, we can't like leave the keys locked in the vehicles for everybody to drive because it's not safe and we don't have access to yeah. each other's garages at home. So this way, if we have like a location to park our vehicles, then we can just leave the keys in them and anybody can drive them and work them, and we'll just work a fleet of ten and not worry about buying more. You know, because surely we're not going to have ten people towing at the same time. And if we do, then be, they should start doubling nice, up. Yeah. yeah. I doubt that would happen. But yeah, sounds like a good plan. we're learning from the toes. We did a PD tow the other day that was way up in Sandy, and some are risky. I don't know if you guys know <laughs> yeah. the difference between a, a normal PD tow and then a state impound tow. Uh huh. Motherfuckers oh, sometimes yeah. just come after their cars and want to get them back. Yeah, I know. So I've had that happen a I few times. Cars. Yeah. So, yeah, I've had so that. just a heads up, well, we, we you get might police, get Normally, we get shot police at. escorts. Right, we're good with that. We're, Even with a police escort, they, we, these motherfuckers don't care. They will shoot yeah. everybody in their way. We are aware out. of physical dangers of the job, so okay. we accept that. Sorry, I didn't mean to cut you out. I'm just really no, excited. Just letting you guys know that shit does happen. I, Sometimes, it, we get wiped and they get the car back. So. To be honest, I, I think that sounds kind of funny if I'm being quite frankly honest. I get excited when you guys give us an escort. I remember that uh, one the other night when, when Super Cop was crying and then the, the tsunami happened. Guys, we're gonna so, we learned something. Uh, yeah, shit's rough sometimes out there. So we towed from Sandy the other day. Sorry, we towed from Sandy the other day and we showed up. Thank God I grabbed a second vehicle, but we showed up and there was two cars, so... We immediately instituted, now we're going to start asking how many vehicles when you guys call, just so if it is more than one, we make sure we're already prepared to show up, you know? So we're working on making everything better one day at a time as we learn from everything, too, so. That's good. My advice for now, try to have Yellow Page presence and, uh, you know, yep. build up that name and reputation. Then, yep. Uh, other things are going to just fall in line. Hell yeah, well, we appreciate it. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time. We'll try not to waste it any further tonight. Not a waste at all, brother. You guys are good. Thank you for recognizing that you were, in fact, wasting our time. I appreciate it. Or that. Gareth yes. Rodham Romper. Sorry. Sorry. Say <laughs> Ernie. You're on one tonight. Oh, damn. That's the diva no, I, in me. I look forward. I look forward to you guys, Um, you know, building up an actual reputation and, uh, I'm ready for this threesome with your husband off the record. I, I have a question. I have a question. Do you guys yes, you know? Yes, you can get beat up by Ashworth before we leave. Well, that one, yeah. Um, that was that's a given. Is it time for 15 um, and 0? Let's watch get, it. Can you get more parking per warehouse? Or is it only up to five? I think it's only up to five. But if you guys get, like, at least two warehouses here, I think that should be plenty. I would say if they're going to lease them, we get the four warehouses. And that would give us 20 spaces for fleet. We wouldn't park any personal vehicles. It'd be fleet. Well, and I, we'll, we'll talk about the agreement, but like Ben was saying, I, we'll, let's start with two. And then and the, and the, and the proposal, we'll say, with the possibility of getting those two over there. Okay, yeah. I mean, yeah. That works. All right. Put that shit on paper. Uh, just so we know what we need to talk to Dynasty about. Yeah. Okay, perfect. All right, All sounds right, good. We'll, we'll, Right. Well, we appreciate you guys coming over here and taking time out of your day and doing this. Really. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. No Love to help whenever we can. All right, Astrid. With that, with that said, Astrid, you want you want to go round fourteen? Come on, fourteen and zero, baby. It might only be fourteen. It's, I'm losing track. 
Let's go. You guys are getting mad swollen. Let's go. Woohoo! Come on, baby! Got Get him! Get him! Kick his ass, Astrid! I don't care about this song. Excuse me? I can file for sealing oh, now, but I don't think any judge will seal while you're still on parole. Yeah, that, that makes sense. That was one of my main questions. <laughs> oh, he's getting his ass kicked. Haha, <laughs> you're already oh, done. You're I have a few already, questions for you as well. He's 13 and 0 against Astrid. This is. Ooh. Kick his ass, Astrid. He can't win. Oh, she let you have that one. Oh, you still fucked up. Oh. Oh. Oh, she got me a little Oh, jeez. Uh oh, tables are turning. Let's go, Bubba. Let's go. What, Gary? Kick his ass! Yeah, I use the heel. Stab him in the gut with your heel. Oh, come on! Don't go down, Astrid! I got faith in you! Oh, ow! No! No! Astrid, kick his ass! Yes! Yeah! Oh, snap! It just wasn't enough. Love to see it. Fucking see it. What did you say about my kid now? Yeah, true. Don't run my pocket, don't run my pocket. What the fuck you got in here? What are these SpongeBob bandages? You needed these. Yeah, I need my SpongeBob bandages. Yeah, you do. Why do you have two Citizen ID cards, bud? Because I was trying to help someone earlier make their ID. It's not my picture. Hey, what's up? Nothing this time. Oh, I've never seen this. Oh, hey, how are you doing? This is a potential future of HTT, maybe one day. Uh, oh my God! Look at this shit. Mm. Uh, oh, we out here. It's okay, Bubba. Uh, Where's Darlene? My favorite. I need to photo bomb this. Fifteen and no, baby. Let's go. Yeah. How close was I? Pretty fucking close. Well, I, oh, every time. You get mad close. Uh, Hi. Sir. Ernie, are you okay? Ernie, put your hands down. Like, what are you doing? Your from here. I was photo bombing. So the CEO said you're such a good person. Don't judge me. Okay. I forgot to ask. Um, oh, okay. Now here's a question, uh, of logistics. Yo, what's up? In order to get a lease. Would we be required to file, like, official licensing with the business committee? Or would we potentially be able to get, like, a lease that outlined no crime? As long as a non-felon can work with us on the contract side of things, it should be fine. Hmm. Yeah, I, I don't know if... Obviously, we can't run out a goddamn building yeah. to a felon. Right, I mean... A PD building. Well, that's, well, that's what I'm saying is... We, we could get some good verbiage in the legal contract recognizing that it's on the up and up and and we could even outline severe consequences All I need to see is a signature from a non fucking fella. Okay. Literally. All right. Well, okay. What about is Bo? Bo, I think's good. I guess I'm just asking cuz we're deciding whether or not like full legit and full fleet of custom trucks and future or you know, more so like the independent everybody owns kind of thing, but we could we could definitely still have a non felon helping with the contracting. All we need. Sounds good. Ernie, you know what I was just thinking? What? If we could get something like this, we could probably get our uh the mechanics to wrap our vehicles in a custom HTT logo thing. Yeah, well we've already got the we've got a couple vinyl designs for it too yeah. that we can Yep. We just gotta submit them. Yeah. You know what I mean, but I don't we can submit them as if we get something like this, we can submit them. We've had those for months waiting yeah, for this know, opportunity. Yeah, true, true. Technically, 
Yeah, that's... That would, be, that would put us a step in, you know, I mean, make us stand out. I think we fucking... could... I think we should think about wrapping the taxis, too, if it grows. Yeah, to a, to a, yeah. We could talk yeah. about that. Like, over time, it doesn't have to happen overnight. Oh, 100%. Sweet. So Slow we know grow, that we can baby. Slow grow. we can do it fully official or not. We just need one non-felon. You forgot your name. The actual paperwork and signatures and the, the lease. I, uh, and all that. Yeah. I put yeah. it on Instagram. Okay. Now, with that being Ernie, said, yeah, that's probably a good thought. I was just thinking that scene. Now, with that being said, um, would we still be able to have people that are founders that have felonies that are within that? contact yeah, that you still you. work with us because we're still part owner we're just not like the official non-felon signing like exactly. could we still work up work our I names mean, into that con how every business entity operates in, in the state as far as i know okay it's like for person, example person who signs a contract is who who needs yeah, to not the be actual up. official owner of the business i think uh, i'm pretty sure they need to be felony free as well as uh, if we're gonna do the the lease thing for the property since it's, you know, obviously a government TV I'll come to building. work for you, right? Yeah. Money straight. Moon will take off. Yeah. Hell yeah. Once again, you need to figure out, find someone you trust that is felony free. Yeah. And, you know, they, they can sign and be legally responsible. I understand. Understand. But we, could, but we could still get a lease without a business license is what you're saying. Yeah. But if we went that route, we'd have to have them on that and the lease. But they have right. to be on the lease for us. Right. That's what I'm getting. Is that what I'm getting? Fully say yes, but yeah, I don't see why not. Cause, yeah. Seeing that we can we can closely monitor and control. Yeah, and that would be the thing the is every going to be doing. Especially with it being a lease, that's that's why I don't see it being a problem having us as contacts at least too in part. You know, because again, it's going to be a full open door lease too. So. The thing is, we can't really justify a lease to just. Uh, around them john though yeah without a purpose so but i mean if you guys back it up with, you know the business and what you get the space for it, it will just make things a lot more easier on our side to be able to lease it okay all right so we'll work so on the logistics the same person you know kind of being up there in the administration of the business will be the same person that takes the lease that would just make things a lot more easier perfect I yeah got, i got a, i got i got the perfect person yep. And, 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 and I, I got the perfect person in mind. The moral of the story is we just want to very much still be fully included in the operations, but we'll make sure we have a point man that is legit. Another example or something that might work, at least from my perspective, I'm not a lawyer though, so don't legally quote me 100% on that. Ben's like, here. Let's say you, Baba, you know, would be felony free, and if you would be the legal owner of the business, you could get could have your lawyer you know sign the lease for the building and facility with us that, that wouldn't be an issue oh so so you'd have your lawyer sign it as a legal contract and then it doesn't matter who specifically i don't think hey you want to be the owner of HTK? okay at that point the lawyer can i'm already the owner of a business Bubba, the owner of two businesses. Bubba, did you hear that though we don't well, i guess i could be so he's he's saying we could potentially have our lawyer sign for the responsibility of the lease and then we could just all operate it. Like, I don't know if a lawyer would want that. What, what do you think about that, Ben? But that, that's that sounds like a, a, issue, a bad deal for me. What uh, it, well, Astrid, you're up next. I don't want to sign on yeah. any contracts for you. All right. We'll figure it out, though. We will figure out our our route. I've got yeah, an idea we'll of somebody. Get we'll, get a, we'll get a representative. I've got an idea. We uh, Trust us. We got this. We got this. We're just trying to make sure we're fully... We don't want to submit a proposal and then have like certain things throw kinks in it if you know what I mean. I, I know. That I makes know. sense. Don't rush it. Trust me. Yeah. Don't, don't rush it. Give us I know some, it's exciting and all that. Some, yeah, give Just, us some time uh, to submit the paperwork. Yeah, there's no rush on our side. I'm not going to lease this shit to anybody else. No one. Perfect. Hell yeah. Appreciate it. You got it. Alright, Bubba, you got your ass kicked. Yeah, you're right. Don't you get beat up by Astrid again? Yeah. I, oh, man. man. Noi. That's exactly who I was gonna say. Noi will sign it. I would. I like that idea better than giving the business to anyone. Just have her sign the lease for us, and then we'll run the business, and she can, yep. she can be a part owner in it. Like we can make her like a part shareholder. She's looking for drivers anyway, so we could just drive for her for free. 
Yes, and we'll use our fleet. Like, it'll just be, as part of that, we'll become her driver for free. Yep. Is she available? That's what I'm calling. Yes, she is. Fucking tell her we need to meet after PD this leaves. Is, hey, this is fucking beautiful. This is beautiful. Nori! Nori! Nori, you here? Charlie? God, she need to souls. multiply. Yeah. I just wanted to say yeah, thanks. Just... What'd you say, Ernie? I was just saying, I just wanted to say thank you for giving us the time of day to speak about it. No worries, homie. No worries. I mean, it means a lot to us. Appreciate that. It's all good. Love to help if possible. Is that comfortable? I lost the car, so my dog... Yeah, it is quite comfy. Oh, okay. Let's try it sometime. It's really comfy when Gary and I were scissoring. Really? Yep. Ever scissored a fellow man? Shre Shredder, he's mean business. Hell yeah. I have not. Oh, look around. You, you, should, you should give it a try, Dex. It's, uh, it's pretty good. Gary's really uh, soft, so. Cabs coming with that like. Oh, Moma, yeah. 44 reactions. Chat, what's up? Shark says, good idea. Chat, Nori's going to be the good one. Yep. Whoever said it, I was already thinking about it. Don't tell her everything. Have her come here. All right, love you. No, I didn't. I just said we're at, we're at an OPD that we're looking to uh, possibly occupy, but that's and he goes she goes what I was like we'll talk about it everything when you get here. I think so that would be the best route to do it first, and then if it keeps working out, we could potentially still think about the idea of going legit. But I still like the idea of everybody owning it, you know. And if we do it the lawyer route and can get a lawyer that will trust us enough to sign on it, which would be Nori, and it's an open door policy, like then I don't see why we would have to even. Did you tell him we got a lawyer coming down here? Mm, no, but I could tell him. I just don't want him to. I just don't want him to leave. You know what I mean? Okay. Yeah, I'll tell you know, him. It doesn't matter. Actually, you tell it him. Doesn't matter. I don't want. I don't want to. I don't want to take too much of his time up. Yeah, me neither. Like, I, I feel honored that he gave us know. time. <laughs> Shit. Dude, this is. I do. So he's like, well, I. Bro. This is, kinda, this is huge. This would be huge for us. It would be you fucking make, huge. I make a contract deal with the fucking PD. A lease, and then I like how they say that they don't believe in exclusivity, like, cause that means yeah. that, like. Yeah, I mean... How's, how's the progress going? Uh, so... Oh, this is fucking huge. We're gonna see if... So, he said that he would do it... That we'd have to have a non-felon do the lease, and we could avoid going full legit, like, if we just at least, at minimum, had our lawyer sign the lease as part of the contract. So, yeah, so we don't need Ben doesn't want to do it. License. Ben doesn't want to do it, but Nori's on her way. We're gonna see if Nori will do it, because she's been having us as her driver and been paying us, and instead, we'll just drive for as part of that contract, and she'll be the leaseholder here, and then we'll all hey, own Ernie, the business why still. Why don't, you, why don't you pull her off to the side and give her, give, we'll give her a pitch about that? Yeah. And so if it works out, then PD is going to put in the warehouses and then lease them to us. And then we're so going to tow for PD and, and return them. with tips. So we're basically going to keep towing for PD for free with tips like we've already been doing, but we're going to get a building. And a place to op operate out of. And honestly, what I would do is ha take, start with these two warehouses. Chat, this is freaking one. huge. What is happening? You know I mean? Sorry, chat. I'm still so eating I, I, and I don't want to eat on camera. Office? Yeah, I was thinking of putting an office scary? door. If we could, if we could get an office store and two warehouses to start, and then we could put in the contract that we might expand to four warehouses if the business evolves and expands. But if we had two warehouses and an office, we'd have 15 spaces to park here. Yeah. If we're leasing it, I say we, if we're only going for two, I see, we should see if they'll furnish it. So wait, so what's the relax? So wait a minute. So, okay. Are they gonna give us like an allowance? No, we should we should shoot for like three hundred thousand dollars. No, they're, they're gonna, gonna pay, they're gonna pay, pay for, for the warehouses and the buildings and then lease them to us and we're gonna operate just like we have been towing for free with tips. Yeah, I really like this spot too. This is a nice fucking lot. So then we don't have to come up with one hundred and sixty grand to get the warehouses. They're gonna lease them to us. Hey, girl! Hi, Ernie! Oh my goodness, we need That's to talk. Is that Nadia? Hi, uh, no. Oh, uh, hi. All right. So no, not you, the, the girl in the red hair. No, that's me. That's my assistant. Oh, okay. fuck. Oh, so, like, no, yeah. God. so check no, this no, out. No, 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 no. Nori. 
I want you to nice to me nice to see you again. I love you, um, but I want you to listen to this pitch. Okay. All right. So we spoke to the chief of police over there, uh, because this space is a rundown uh, PD space, and. Uh, Dynasty couldn't sell it to us because PD may eventually, you know, remodel it. Um, but we brought the chief down here and talked about it and, you know, brought up, you know, what if we were open to imminent domain, you know, eventually we could move out, you know, and you could buy it back. And he kind of turned it and he said, well, what if to make things easier, what if you submitted a proposal of, you know, how many warehouses you would need, how many office spaces... And then PD could purchase the warehouses and the office space and then lease them to you to tow for PD for free plus tips, like we've been doing. Well, and, and we, can, we, can, we can work this in with your halfway house because some of your people that you're here can also work for us. Because what we, mm -hmm. what our plan is and what we've told PD is, you know, Whitley and I have both done 450 months and, you know, we've been out here towing and kind of doing things better and... Uh, you know, Pookie, he's out on parole, and this has kind of been his, his haven. He's bought a truck, he's really excelled, and so we want to return that for other parolees. Like, people out on parole, like, the judge can assign them to work service with HTT. And mm -hmm. we'll hire them, because we hire all felons. And mm -hmm. so, yeah, and so he liked it, and he said that maybe they could lease the buildings to us for that operation purposes, and to keep a presence of towing and everything and but the catch is he said we would need a non-felon on the lease and or we would need a non-felon to complete a business proposal and actually go legit but we're not sure if we want to go that full route fully yet because we're kind of like a employee owned company and you know but we promise no illegal behavior and the lease is going to be an open door lease so they can come in at all times and see yeah, so they would have, one of them would have a key. So the moral of the story, he said if we could have our lawyer sign the lease for us as well, they would be open to that as well and let us operate if our lawyer signed the responsibility knowing that we're not going to operate anything criminal out of the operations. They said what we do off the clock, you know, if we get in trouble, like, because, you know, people make mistakes, our employees make mistakes. Mm -hmm. As long as it's not on the clock, they're not going to... So basically what we're asking is, you know, we're your drivers and we're thinking maybe we could take quit taking pay from you and just offer you the driving service when you need it and we're available like we have been. And as part of that, mm -hmm. you could be the one to sign the lease for us. And also we'd make I you mean, part shareholder. You see that? I mean, honestly, I think it's a really good idea, guys, and it aligns with what I want to do, but we got to make sure that, you know, it's a thorough, concise plan. You guys, uh, can, I can I can put the, the, the meat and stuff together, and I can talk to you about it with my business partners, but if you guys can give me the logistics and show me how it would work, like pen to paper, I mean, I would be willing to stand well, behind it and put my name on it as long as you can promise that nothing legal is going to happen or illegal is going to happen. Yeah. We can drop our own terms and conditions and agreements for that as well, too. 100 percent. 100 percent. And the chief said that we would have we would right now what he was waiting on from us would be basically what he would need from us. How many how many warehouses, how many garages, things, if construction, whatever, whatever. And then what, you know, like more or less like. Not a business proposal, but more, what, what would you say, Ernie? More like a... Um, what we need. Why, and, and what we're going to do out of it. You know what I mean? Kind of like a business mm. proposal, but more like what we need. And, so I'm, yeah. I'm going to draw up with a business proposal that starts with present what we need, but then also expand on what our goals and plans are for future growth and yeah. expanding mm -hmm. so that they know all I outcomes. Think, Plus... Yeah. In full disclosure, we'll disclose, we do have, uh, we have an HR department that we're forming, and we do have set Ooh. policies in stone, and so, like, we do hold people accountable, and, you know, there's some things that is first-time offense, a strike, and then termination, you know, like, so, you know, we're taking and, it serious, so we're not gonna let people and just do business. anything. Within that lease, the chief said that, uh, from what my understanding is they would purchase the warehouses, and we would just rent from them. Mm -hmm. Still want to figure out the cost of the warehouses and how, like how much that they would be looking like their scope of spending, so that you could also budget that against like you know net net worth profitability throughout like a quarterly or you know show them too. If even if you put this amount of money in, how are 
we going to show the PD that it was worth it? You know what I mean? By re investing, but you know what I mean? Just yeah, yeah, providing back money into the society. I also like the idea of having the opportunity to have those who maybe have an intensive or extensive criminal records or who may be looked at a bit differently to have the opportunity to work and not well, be. Well, Ernie pitched that with the, you know, that we would work with DLC and then if people were coming out on parole, that um, we would offer them a job to work here and keep clean and you know what i mean like not stay out of trouble stuff like mm -hmm. that i already pitched that to him so like we would even be willing to take it where deal like we could do a contract where doc where the judges could actually like know that we're already authorizing whatever they send our way and they could literally put like if they said to somebody your terms is to work for htt then we would hire them to get them out of prison and then show them some sort of rehabilitation back into society i do love the idea and i'm willing to back you guys for it i mean We've been discussing about, you know, how we can get you guys on top. And I think that this is an awesome opportunity. I think that you guys can do it. I mean, you know what lines that should never be crossed when it comes to, you know, the criminal aspect of things. And I think that you guys can do it really well. Right. Well, and, and mm -hmm. I, I expressed all the concerns with the chief. And that's how we got to the point where he said he would even consider if a lawyer would sign on to the lease. Because mm -hmm. I told him, I said, you know, we are, most of us are felons. But we operate mm -hmm. this with the idea of hope for other felons. And we don't want to lose our individual shareholder identity by, you know, assigning one person ownership, too. Whereas, in this case, we would still maintain ownership. It's just you're taking the ownership of the lease kind of thing. And obviously, we would, well, and with would that, we'd be... give you shareholder with the company. Yeah, but and I would even be able to look into, like, let's say people do come and work for you guys. And maybe working with the state in regards to maybe some sort of not disc di expungements now are fifty thousand dollars and that's just your base rate on top of the charges you'll have to pay for all of your you know paying back the additional charges like the expungement how it calculates out you pay quite a hefty amount a lot of people they're can't twins afford that. oh yeah they are so twins maybe we can have a funded uh a state fund a rehabilitation fund for people um who maybe do want to have all of their like their record completely expunged but maybe can't afford it and who are working this job um right some, you know, money towards their expungement like do like something that. like yeah. if if they come work for us for so many hours they can work off part a credit towards their expungement kind of thing like yeah kind that's, of thing yes i like it if we can draw up something solid and you can present me with something solid and you could we can both and all come into agreement like there cannot be anything illegal in these properties so 100%. Ever get, if and two like there's going to be a clause in where if you guys get raided that's all, like i I'll, I'll lease it i can take ownership and responsibility for it and i will uphold my my inspection rates and stuff like that and business committee will come in and inspect and do that but you there will be no illegal activity in these properties um 100 percent and that is what and yeah so okay i mean yeah tell them that you 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 would have your lawyer sign on to the lease and she's willing to work with you collaboratively i love um, you um as long as you can provide me with a really good document and then i can i can fluff it up and i'll talk here with my other um uh, you guys partners. look like sisters all right we kind of like our sisters from other misters we should just start saying we so are. here's we the thing do. so side note um off the record mm-hmm can she hear this? About what? Just about anything? Off record? Yeah. That's her, that's her partner. Okay. Oh, yeah. That's my business partner. She's the founder of... So... Yeah. She uh, would be heavily involved in this too, likely, if, like, uh... And I'm well, all I mean, this for it. Off the yeah, record... I'm really quiet, but I'm really all for it. So, off the record, a lot of us are criminals, and will unfortunately probably keep making mistakes. <laughs> Here and there, right? Yeah. We have yeah. poor appetites and poor judgment calls. But, 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 150% when it comes to HTT, we have good judgment. And nothing will be wrapped up with HTT ever. Nothing will ever be done on the clock. And also, HTT mm -hmm. is now officially fully separate. I mean, we have employees who are part of our family. But mm -hmm. HTT is now being treated separately. Man if you know what I mean, from our family. So we are hiring non-family members to work for us and keeping it fully separate. Um, and I made it aware to the chief, like, I can't control people. You know, we hire criminals. I can't control their behavior outside of work, but I can guarantee when they are working, they're 100% professional and, you know, not 
doing things, but if they make mistakes, you know, that's certainly not on us, you know? And and he said that's yeah, fine. I, he said he can't hold a standard like that. So he seemed pretty okay with it. There might have to be certain stipulations in which, like, people would have to meet. Like, even you guys do commit crimes and mess up every once in a while, but you're not causing, like, complete and total chaos. You're not putting people's lives in danger. If anything, you're... It's, it's, it's quite... It's uh, it's a breath of fresh. I'm not trying to say you're gonna say crime's a breath of fresh air, but I mean sometimes you know your I'm forms of crime are a little bit more heartwarming. <laughs> you're not trying to like call people names and rage on them and be ignorant, and rude, and you know all that kind of stuff. And yeah. We all make mistakes, but you guys aren't naive to that. So yeah, no, I yeah. like it. But um, I mean, honestly, if somebody catches a hut or a murder charge, we're gonna have to look at their employment. Uh, yes. Yeah. 100%. And, and we will work with, because even if we don't, again, like, even if we, we, you know, business committee may be a future thing, too. You know, that's a possibility in the future growth, but starting here is I a good... Need one. Starting here is a good milestone to get somewhere and maybe decide that. But even if we stay fully employee-owned, 100%, if somebody fucks up really bad, we may have to consider their employment. Um, 100%. But that's not to say that if they don't work through it and get back out on parole that we wouldn't, like, possibly rehire somebody if they were trying to do better. You know what I mean? Like, because we always want to be open to rehabilitation, and some people will continue to make mistakes. But And when they cross that line, what they will do is they'll kind of go into the legal jurisdiction of the, I guess, the back end of the system. Because I guess that's kind of also the catch-22 guarantee they get is if they do screw up, they're going to the firm that can quickly review and then delegate this to the correct attorney that can handle this situation and want to go to bat and then like Audra and I can ensure that people are following through on cases in such case like Pookie Wookie. He had Trembley, who was his uh, lawyer. I mean, had he had maybe a different lawyer who wasn't as passionate, would that have gotten done as quickly? No. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, so he'll we'll have that insurance so that we can try and hopefully guide them through the justice system as humilious as possible, you know? I like it. Can I see something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. Hey. Hi, my name's Audra. Um, we've talked in passing. Um, but I just have to say, like, I am, you know, not really been watching you, but I've noticed since you guys first started coming around as well, the growth that you guys have made in towards being, like, you know, like better people. And I really admire it. And so seeing you guys, like, talk about this and wanting to do this, do stuff for you know, parolees or whatever, like, I really, I am 100% behind this as well. Mm -hmm. Um, before I was a lawyer, I was in GSF, and I had a pretty lengthy record. Um, so I'm all for people, you know, like, making their lives around for the better, you know what I mean? So I just want to say I'm 100% on board with this. Appreciate it, that's exciting. Yeah, we're kind of like dog bounty hunter, you know, we catch felony, but then we, <laughs> yeah. but then we catch other people, and we, you know, I mean, we try to help them. You guys are just like kind of like and boosting positivity and, and making yeah. it a lot more lighthearted. We're trying to better the better the economy around here, but, you know, the better civilian life. And I was explaining yeah. to the chief that we also Why have we also have an extensive training program in place already mm -hmm. that hyper focuses on professionality and really going above and beyond on every single toe, not just. Not just showing up to take your vehicle because you broke down, recognizing the customer's need at that moment and recognizing their situation and sympathizing with their situation as well as helping them. And so we're, we're really encouraging our employees that all sign on that they continue to give that service that all of us started the company with, um, if you know what I'm saying. So really yeah, hyper-focused. You, know. you guys have been through the ringer. <laughs> you guys have. Our employees uh, yeah, all have, for, you ready for, you ready we, for this? we have direction traffic cones inside of our trucks, so everyone, we can direct traffic if we're in multiples. Every driver has a tablet, so they can clock in on our portal and, you know, yeah. things like that. They've also got clipboards with paperwork, like, we're super prepared and ready. Mm -hmm. Off the record. Off the record. Off the record. If Nadia gets arrested and goes to prison, and she becomes a felon, and then she comes out and she can't get work at her business at the, at the NTJ. So then she has to come work with us because we're, she's a felon. Full circle. Full circle, oh, my friend. That is the most petty thing I've ever heard. And this just gained so just, much respect from me. I'm just kidding. Me. I just, listen, no, no. Yeah. Yeah. You just gained so much respect from me. To be, how petty you guys that was. If I'm being completely <laughs> honest, 
this all was originally, all we wanted to do was tow. We never had a plan to be big or really compete. Like, we just wanted to tow. Yeah. But yep, now, sure. we want to give other people, now that we have fought for that ability, we want to give back and give other people that are just starting out towing the ability to tow mm. underneath you know, a name that will get them jobs and also them. not get pressed. I kind of want to talk about this right real quick. Our goal is to make it to where other people can tow under a reputable name that they get busy and they don't get harassed. I just want to say something real quick before the store comes. This whole thing that's been going on with Nadia, right? It's kind of, it's kind of been like a blessing in disguise because if it wasn't for, we, like he said, we just want, we were just going to tow. We really weren't going to make anything of it. We probably wouldn't even be towing. Yeah. Right now. If, if, if all that shit wasn't going on. We down. probably would be working for somebody else right now instead yeah. of working for ourselves. Right. But because of all that shit that's going down, we kind of have to make our, we kind of have to work for ourselves and make a name. So we just stuck with what we know, and that's towing. So she's kind of like fed fuel to this fire. She's and kind of been a blessing in disguise. She really has. Well, well I, I told you guys to kind of like not give up what you're doing. You know what I mean? Well, stick with it. Keep on going. Because and uh, just keep on bothered, and it's bothered her. If it wasn't for her pressing us, I don't think we would have had came up. I don't think we would be thinking about... I don't think we'd be building bigger now. I mean, I just... It's just... After after getting... After going through what we've gone through, we've actually met several employees that felt the same way. And so that's another reason why we kind of try to... Why we kind of try to keep it employee-owned. Because it's what basically a way of saying... Yeah, and it's yes, basically... 100%. And this is basically a way for people to be able to tow independently, but work underneath a shared umbrella, in a way, you know? But, not monopolize it and make people feel like yeah. they should fear to do their job. And... Everybody yeah, like is allowed it. to tow, and, you know, we aren't trying to run any business out either. Like, Nadia is free to tow. That's not our goal. Like, uh, I wish we could get along and, and, and maybe work together one day, because, you know, like, it would make... Yeah, that bridge has been burnt. But that's my... <laughs> <laughs> Burn, crumble to ground. But that's the thing yeah, is... Well... We're yeah, not trying to take thing. anyone out. We just want to grow and continue to work to Justice make Los Santos better. So many ways too, where it's like I wanted I'm to feeling. like slap down and intend to sue against her, but you know I don't want to rattle the cage right now. Yeah. Yeah. And like as you soon as that does like go out and all those place. arrests goes out, I am slapping down that intent to sue, and yeah. that's gonna even be more for yeah, you know what I mean. So do you think we're still headed in that direction, or do you think that it's yeah. stalling? Oh, okay. So yeah, future of HTT. Future of HTT, we're growing strong. Chat, we're doing it. We're gonna grow. Chat, if you haven't hit that like button yet, we're at 48 reactions. Help us get to 50. Nope, nope. Here you go, Astrid. I'll keep you dry. Oh, but did you hear what he said? He said he doesn't have a wide enough camera lens. This motherfucker scammed me out with 10 grand the other day. I scammed him up 10 grand yesterday, so. And then I gave him 10 grand today. Yeah, he gave, yeah, and then he gave me seven grand today. Oh, so. Yeah, you did scam on a ten grand. Yeah, no, you're no, only ten grand. No, but then Nori tried to scam me for scamming you. Because I said, Nori, what's the, I said, Nori, what's the bank account? So she gave, I said, what's his bank account? Because I want to give it back. She gave me her bank account, but I was smart. I sent a dollar to see whose bank account it was. Ooh, that's yeah. smart. You had a moment. I had an idea. Like a light bulb. And she texted me and said, are you kidding me? A dollar? Did you scam? <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, you can't scam a scammer. Can't scam a scammer. As much as my retainer. I think we made 
This oh, man goes, hey, we... here's your retainer. It hands me a dollar. I'm like, oh. Okay. Yeah, at least he understands your value. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> priceless. A dollar is priceless to you. Well, it depends. But I think we made a lot of headway here, Arnie, to be honest with you. Hello? Uh, I agree. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, sorry! Whoa! <laughs> that, that, was, that was me, too. That's your job, is to beat me? Yep, pretty much. Yeah. Sorry. At this point, I think I'm going to get some, like, knuckle duster. That's the only way I'm going to win. No, you can't get knuckle no. duster. You hit me no, with knuckle not duster, I'm just pulling out my fucking flashlight, beating the fuck out of you. Okay, some mag light. I'm going to not get up. Hey, maybe we can put a, 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 a fighting ring over there in the corner. And if an employee has problems with each other, we're like, yeah, I am. They acquire the compound first for business purposes. Ooh, yes. They acquire the compound for business purposes, and then you can discuss as the co-op activities. Oh, my bad. I mean, I'm... Why can I expect your guys' proposal? Ernie, what do you expect from the proposal? I'd say by the weekend at the latest. I'm going to work on it tomorrow. Yeah, I need a couple of logos or anything like that. Just let me know. But like I said, we already got um, fucking illegal. That's we already illegal. Got, we already got layout for the vinyl wrap that we want to do for the vehicles. Yeah. Yeah, we've actually had one for several months. Yeah, we just never. Like, eh. We ordered it. It's uh, just We're kind not. of been sitting in the shop waiting for them to put them on the truck. So we have, oh, did we? We ordered it? Well, no. Like, I mean, we've got the vinyl. Yeah, but we haven't ordered it. Yeah, we haven't paid the mechanic to put it on. Yeah. Well, once we pay the mechanic, I think it takes four to seven weeks for it to be put on. Yeah, okay. Well, you guys have been really good at practicing your patience as it is, so... Yeah. Thanks, Tell me about it. No That's joke! Why are you standing like that? That's why are you worried about what I'm doing? Yeah, don't worry about Astrid. Hand on the hip, cock sideways. Do you want her to kick oh your ass gosh, again? The Ernie. Damn, bro, that's iconic. Actually, iconic. I'm just serving up the sass. What's up, Jack? This is some. This is some good news. Honestly, is, is Nori on board? Uh, yeah. She said that if we come up with a good, solid proposal, she'll work on the legality of the contract, but she'll sign the lease. Son of a bitch, that's great news. I mean, we could arrange that. Well, son of a bitch. Yeah. I think this is great. I'm gonna come this up. Gonna take, this is gonna take ACT to the next level. 100. percent So having our own lot like that's all. That's huge. Yep. Where's Bo? He should come over and see this. Right. Call him. Yeah, who you call? I'll call him right now. Oh, never mind. He's not around. Damn. This is some great shit. Uh, so this is the potential future of, uh, HTT. No, uh, HTT, Jack. HTT. So we're looking at, uh, we're not gonna own it, though. I mean, we're gonna own the company, but we're looking at leasing these buildings from PD. They're gonna come in and renovate it, and then we're gonna sign a lease with them. Well, Nori, our lawyer, is gonna sign the lease, and then we're gonna occupy it and run the company out of it. Who's gonna run the company? You what? Who's gonna run that company? All of us. For now, we're we make. You what? What a what a the keys or the cops will have keys to the place though. Yeah, so it's it's hundred percent legal. They no. Why the fuck not? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Why the fuck not? Wait, which one? The big warehouse? Yeah. Why would you give them keys to that? I said, are we keeping it? Oh 
Jack, you. Oh, yeah, yeah. This is just for the business. Here, Jack. You say it, Jack. It looks like you might be a paint. Yeah, Jack, this won't be for anything illegal or for us, or for hobos. This is for HTT. Fuck, I ain't gonna be stepping foot in here, dude. I'm about to go cut somebody's head off. Oh, the, shit. The goal is to get a bunch of management and then let them kind of run it. Hey, I wonder if there's cameras in here. Yeah, I, I I don't know. Maybe. Let me take a look. Yo, Chad, hit that like. We're at 49 reactions. Cruise coming in with that like. Yo, I'm back. I finished eating. Uh, and I, what I want to do with one of the warehouses is I want to I'll build it up one of the warehouses and like make it like a legit hey, like, have an office, an office space. Right yes. Chat, this is huge. So if you guys are just tuning in, uh, sorry, I've been ignoring chat. <laughs> hey, you don't want, why don't you guys go inside that garage where you don't have to be in the rain? Dude, that's a good idea. I wonder. You what? Oh, snap. Please. I don't know if I have time. Strings are broken. Oh, she had, oh shit, okay. I, sh I can't get my uh she was so excited you can't believe that you're once around. Hang on, chat. Yeah, my controller is not working, chat. Sucks, it didn't work. Chat, you guys want to hear the hobo song? <laughs> Chat, if you haven't hit that like button, we just hit 50 follow or we just hit 50 reactions. Anish coming in with that follow. Welcome, welcome.
Chat, how's everybody's night going? Y'all are quiet, chat. How's everybody's night? Appreciate that follow. M with that like. Cruz with that like. I appreciate it. Muhammad with that like. That sucks. My, uh, so my Rewas, which is a controller app that I use that like, basically I can switch it to push to talk. That wasn't working. looking at all the photos on the screen my cousin really lowered in california on the electric guitar i mean a friend went there for a dime bag oh damn good i'm just over here lurking waxing and polishing the navi Ooh, nice chat we are totally on track for some good shit i'm gonna wake up at the last location I don't even remember what the radio channel was. Hey, I forgot the old radio. See if Bubba's awake. No, he ain't awake yet. This will be a good tow lot, chat. This will be a good tow lot. I should have woke up at the warehouse like everybody is going to do. But good thing I have a gun in my pocket. Damn. Yeah, it would be cool if they could put a gate there. That'll be a cool spot. Even without a gate, that'll be a really cool spot. Because it's like right next to the city. Look, there's already a bunch of tow trucks down here. So it's like tow truck capital. Oh yeah, I would have to come over this bridge and then the warehouse is right there. So the warehouse is right around the corner from it. My bad, chat. Let's pretend that didn't happen. I totally forgot the radio channel. Oop. I guess I could turn that guitar home off. What's the new radio channel? Um, 456.3. Okay. I couldn't remember. All right. Sounds good. Where are you at? Uh, I woke up at the, uh, where we fell asleep at. Oh, yeah, I did too, and then I grabbed the car. Oh, can you come back and pick me up? Yeah, sounds good. Ah, uh, sweet. All right, sounds good. I'll be there. I think that'll be great using our lawyer to start we're still on the fence like there's potential for like full legit business but we just need to figure that out 
Um, but we're going to have our lawyer sign the contract so that it's a non-felon signing the contract. Um, and then they'll work with us all on the business. So that'll be great. What up, homie? Yes, sir. Let's just soak this in one more time. This is, this, is, this is gonna be it, man. I really do. Oh, especially if we go the lease route. I like how I like how you were like. That's not you were like. Uh, what'd you say? If he says yes, you're gonna be like, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. <laughs> now you're like, let's get it, let's get it. Only because he offered the lease part. Like that right there makes it easier to achieve, you know. And yeah, yeah, one hundred percent, one hundred percent. And helps lock that down and, and kind of gives us a relationship with them to expect more toast from us, you know? I think it's a great idea. And I, I like it. I think it's a great idea, too. And the fact that Nori is on board and she said that she'll sign for us, it's just even even amazing. And it's just like, you know what I mean? Like, people are on our side. And it, and it helps that the Asher loves us. She vouches for us, you know what I mean? She's the one that got this connection. Uh, for us to link because I called her and she's like, well, you got to talk to the chief and I was like, well, can you set up a meeting for us? And she's like, yeah, I'll set it up right now. Really? Yep. Yeah, no, sometimes, I... sometimes it pays to know, to know people. Right. Well, and I think like, and I, I like that they're, I like that they're willing to let us use our lawyer as the signature so that we and, could keep operating as shareholder owned and not have to like, you know, I'm glad fully straighten like, our ways. When I, when I first came into this city, I was, you know, towing and I was, I was actually telling a lot for PD um, before the, the rest of you were guys who were able to catch a flight in here. And I'm glad I was able to make connections with some of the people that I made it. And Ashley and Gary were like one of the ones that right. I, was, I, I got close with. So I, it's honestly like it's nice sometimes. No, I think that helps a lot. Plus, I think that we've done a really good job this last couple of weeks helping tow oh, for yeah. PD. And I think oh, we've yeah. made a noticeable. Yep. Uh, they, um, it, all the uh, HTT employees, you know what I mean, have been really doing good and towing and and we they've been reporting it and stuff like that and they've been doing a lot of police uh tows and uh, just really putting our names out there you know it really helps yep the biggest thing that we need to do is we need to make sure like we need to get everybody that's in hobos to really get on board with we don't mix business with pleasure 100%. and because like we can't get them wrapped up like it has to be legit and legal we cannot do anything illegal. And that's another thing that I like about where the warehouse is. It's, it's away from here. Yes. So 100% everything on that on that property is 100% nothing illegal comes on that property, period. And we need to distinguish Hobo Channel and HTT Channel and distinguish who should be in what ones and Hello? focus it because we can't fuck this up. Like, Well, obviously, if when we're towing, we just need to be in the HTT. But when we're out doing shit like we're doing, you know what I mean? Yeah. We need to stay in the hobo channel and not when we need to be careful what we say over to HTT channel. Yes, 100% and around HTT only employees. And um, I suggest because Bo's around a lot even after the storm. And I suggest that if, if there's a um, we, we could give maybe give Bo the channel. Maybe I don't know yet. Maybe give Bo the channel. And if he needs to reach or he could just call us and say, hey, can one of y'all hop on the HTT channel? You know what I mean? Yeah. I think Colling's a good place to start until we know for sure, yeah. you know. Yeah. But we just yeah. we have to focus on separating them, if we, especially if we're going this route, because because if we're going this route, we're going to be highly scrutinized. Watch out! This car, this car came out of nowhere. And you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, I agree, I agree. But this route also takes pressures off of like if Nori's willing to sign that, that takes pressures off of us happen to money -wise, yeah money wise money wise Bubba. and like record wise yeah. how many how many dale cards you got uh i think I you guys should think... be really strict oh, on the new people that come in and just I wanted, I wanted to give warn them that you're a, giving a them a chance to have a job to straighten their life out and not do stupid stuff away. no i don't want to give them oh 100 out there that's not hobo not to have them 100 right, well, give them a book of dale uh, if you catch them doing that's, something that's wrong, your guys, that's your thing. This yep. is PSA team. Yep. And that's the plan, no, Josh. We have, we actually have an HR department set up. Keith, thank you so much for that like. We set up an HR department, which we'll hire people into. Um, yeah, we're, uh, we're doing it fully legit. That way, this, 
because really the city doesn't want you mixing crime with that and we're showing them we're still going to be criminals and that's okay we're going to have one legal person which is required but we're going to use our lawyer instead of one of us which is should still be legal like it's a it's a she's going to be ownership basically um and we're still going to commit crime but outside of the business the business will be 100 percent legal 100 percent but it may not become official it may become official one day but official takes a long time and it's a long process and one person has that ownership but i mean as long as they'd be willing to put us all on like talk to us all and work with us we'd be good with that too so we just got to figure it out but right now a good route is having our lawyer sign it um as long as our lawyer signs it then we're good to start you know what i mean What's up? Bubba, he just unlocked it. Yeah, where you going? Hey, can you hear me? Yeah, I want to hear you. We need you to tell them about the book. The, God, tell them about the book. The book or the card? The book. What's up, Ben? What up, gentlemen? How's it going? Oh, a lawyer and a weed dealer. Hell yeah! I actually, uh, own this place. Oh, oh really? Know. Jack of all trades. Nah, I'm just a stoner and a... Uh, no drugs in pockets or stolen items from houses or cars? I wanted to, uh, bring to you... Yep. Uh, something very special to us hobos, okay? And, uh... Okay. It's, uh, kind of like a religious, uh, <clears throat> item, uh... We we don't practice a religion, right? <clears throat> but we do we do do things on Dale, okay? Hundred percent. Uh, everything that you need in life, you know, Dale will provide for you. And mm -hmm. uh, you know, Bubba Bubba has really, you know, Bubba Bubba. Gary says hello. Oh, he can't see us. No for some reason. Come out, oh, you can't see us. We're in here. You just can't see us for some reason. Let's go outside. Here, yeah. let me get the book. I put We can stand in the lobby. We can stand in the lobby. You can see him in here. You see? Can you see us? Can you see? Yep, I can see you guys. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see everybody but Pookie. I think Pookie's gotta go outside and come back in. Oh, okay. Hold on. Yeah, just go outside and come back in. You're good after that. Okay. All right, so maybe you want to give them a little word about, you know, the, the book of Dale, you know, the good word of Dale. Well, he is certainly our fearless leader and and chief and, Thank you. you know, he he definitely has the power to help you change your life and help you achieve things that you need, obviously with your own self-direction. Quote, he goes hard, he turns left. What else, Pookie? I can't remember. Oh, uh, Bubba, bu bu what was he? He, uh, he raised hell. Well, I know raise hell, praise Dale. Oh, yeah, raise hell. Raise hell, praise Dale. He goes hard, turn left, and he only did, he only made a right turn once. Yep. And unfortunately, just like Pink Floyd, their number one hit was The Wall. Oh, God. That was when he made his right turn. Yep. Yeah. You know, his only one. Became his biggest hit. <gasps> Dale. In his life. Praise Dale. I love him. Praise Dale. Praise Dale. So anyways. Cookie. I can't wait to get, I can't wait to get to heaven and just touch his luscious mustache that he has. Basically, it's, I just so want to pass on, okay, right there oh, in the geez. counter. Uh, yeah, right. no, I see it now. It is a very uh, coveted item to the hobos, and I'm glad to pass one on to you because... You we just know, gave him a book of Dale, Dale chat. Really, uh, <laughs> you know, we gave him a book person, of Dale, which so, is an item made you know, in the city that, book, that uh, it, you know, in the, uh, uh, Buddy Flowers had as his item made. Path, you know, a good path. I appreciate it, buddy. Um, I don't have anything special, but I do have some vapes on there for you. Oh, oh hell yeah, you know I love vapes. 
Fuck, I want one. Gotta be don't quicker steal, than that. Don't steal all my fakes, baby. I can't get in it. <laughs> Let me in it. Shit, I don't want to give you cash. All right, I got him. It was only one on the counter. Oh, that was it? That was only one? That, that was a lie. 100%. <laughs> no, I got four. What? I want one. That's all that was there. How many did you give, Ben? One for one for each of us. Ben, I was got there four. four. I'll give you a couple. Yeah, I got some more. Oh, there you go. All right, tell me when. All right, there's a couple for each of you. Hold up. I got four on me. I'm good. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, I don't walk yet. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. Hey, they, oh, he's gonna sing they had a guitar in the uh, corner of the lobby over there. Oh, yeah, he Ooh. found his guitar. So to commemorate that book, we have a song for you. This is kind of like the anthem. It's unfinished, but it is definitely going to be a crowd pleaser. Yeah. All right. <sighs> I love this song. This song is so good. How long did these last the door. 16. 16 what? He's locking the door? I think it's 16 hits he said or something. Her bait? Target 32? Hey, what's up, ganger? How you doing, man? What up, dog? Chill it, chill it. Hey, how many hits? I can't see the ganger or Ben no more. No. Yeah, you wanna you wanna hear a song? Yeah, let's hear it. Bye bye, Who is our, who is he talking to? Hobo gang. Yeah, the leader of Hobo Gang. Go ahead. Alright, are you guys ready? Yeah, let's hear it, bro. I can't see Ernie or hear Ernie. I need Ernie to go outside. Jesus. Oh, man. What's that? Shit up your back. Yeah, there we go. You good? Yeah, yeah. Can you hear him? Can you see him? No, no, no. It's okay. It's okay. Just do oh, your I thing. Can. Tragic. Get a hold of that guitar again, honey. Yeah, we would all have to run outside. They probably don't see me either. I can see you. Okay. Let I me don't... tell you a story about a fearless leader and chief. His name is priceless as can be He's got the power to bring you to Your knees I'm deal You can't do everything that you need You don't need nobody Set you free. That's right. On deal, you can do everything that you need. You don't need nobody. On deal, just believing will set you free. That's right. On deal. Yeah, you like that, bro. That's lit. On deal, man. 
You better I'm record down. that and you better put it up for the music industry to hear that shit, bro. Hell yeah, we're yeah, working we're on working it. On, yeah, we're working on it, man. I'm 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 coming out with some rap, you know, some oh, rap yeah? tracks this shit. I got one called Raise Hell, Praise Dale. Ooh, Raise you know? Hell, Praise Dale. Yeah, yeah, Raise Hell, called, Praise Dale. Ain't no fucking no. way. And that one's about ain't how no. we ain't gonna die like no bitches. Like yeah. Billy plays. I, I mean, <laughs> uh, man, you didn't hear that. I'm sorry. That's my lawyer. Uh -huh. I can't. I can't. <laughs> Sorry, Minor you're outburst. Crazy. Nah, you're crazy, bro. It's good to see y'all, though. Hey, yeah, yeah, you too, you. man. Yeah. Don't you you forget. Your songs, man. On Dale, you can do anything. You're, you're shooting people. Yeah, you know the vibes, bro. Hell yeah, dog. Good luck, yeah. man. You too, man. I don't do that I anymore. Do I, I just make I, I just make sick rap, rap tracks. But yeah, anyway, yeah. Hell yeah, Ben. Um, I just wanted to bring you that book and... You well, know, I appreciate what up, chat? So chat, what did you think of Ondale? A little bit of a song, you know, my buddy Ernie over here, he's got some real talent, you know. We need to I go uh, find it. Astrid and awesome. play it for him. That if you is, guys that's need true. anything, uh, just reach out. You know how to get catch me. If I'm not here, you know, send me an email. I'll be here very quickly. Appreciate All right, it. thank you so much, Ben. Have a good one. Have a Thanks, good night. Thanks, Ben. Stay safe. Hey, have a good one, man. Yeah, I got, hey, hey, I got something. Kind of mini war right now. Well, so it's not really the time. Uh, we're dealing with the Gambinos right now. Who the oh fuck shit! Is the Gambinos. Uh, it's, we're not alone. That's beefing with them. Happy's boys are dealing with them. Fucking. Oh, they don't. On so they, they, they You can't do people. anything uh, that you need. You don't Party need anymore. nobody on Dale. Just believe it will set you free. On Dale. I'd like to keep that business tag, my brother. I love it too. Cody says, I love that song. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. Take care. Hey. Making connections with the gang, baby. Making connections. Hell yeah. Who's he with? He's been he's been a uh, like a kind of like a uh, a friend of mine for a little while. Now. Well, I ran into <laughs> he uh I shot him. Well, me and Jack shot him and his girlfriend down. <laughs> oh, well, that that's in the past. Yeah, and, and he uh he shot us all up underneath. He, he sh hey, shot up, us guys? all up. Hey, what up, homie? Who the fuck Jul are you? Julian Boss uh, did. Who is this rat? Yeah. Who, Who the fuck are you? Came out of the sewer this Danny Jones. Danny Jones. My name is Danny Jones. Danny. I think his name is Shredder. What is your name, rat? Yeah, rat. Yeah, what's your name? Yeah, you oh, rat. Yeah, my, my rat's name is Shredder. Yeah, we oh, know you. You're a rat. What, Shredder, what what's his name? Where is he? Um, Dale, Ernie, I think we should go in the warehouse and tell them about what, we're, what you and I were talking about after, right after storm. Bubba. Come here. I'm just kidding, Willie. Come here. Yeah. Ask that stranger if he's got a song to play, too. You're not a What's wrong? What's wrong? <laughs> oh, yeah, no. Hey. Hey, hey, do you have, do, hey, do you have a song to play? A song? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a song, you know. Play it. <laughs> what song? The one song. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that means. What do you mean? What do you mean, what do you mean? Huh? Oh, you got a song? Sing your dang song. Sing your song. <laughs> what song? You been making a song? You made a song. I, no, I did not. Oh, the hell? Hey, that person done circle back. <laughs> they did. I don't know um, about that song. They circle block. I can do anything you want. I can suck dick if you want to. <laughs> what? <laughs> And lips. Oh, wait, wait, I don't what? care you if got... it's covered oh, in poo. Look at this circle back again. What? You got a problem? Hey! Who is this? Oh. Wow. 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 Okay, then. Yeah. I'll be a monkey's ass. I'll be a shit covered I'll be dick. I'll be a shit covered dick. <laughs> I'll be a shit covered split. On Dale, you better eat and drink. Oh shit. You're right. I fucking no, man. I don't know. Speaking of, I, bet, I love it. I bet I he's got a song. Huh? <laughs> I bet he's got a song.
Babe's got me fucked up. Oh, fuck. Oh, I fucking love you, Ernie. <laughs> Are you excited about this lease opportunity, guy? Dude, like, this so we're gonna have to strengthen down. Like, we're gonna have to make sure no employee has any illegal items on them when they're working. Like, leave them at your house. Like. Oh, fucking A, man. That shit was fucking hilarious. <laughs> we should have just gone inside. What? I stole his cord. You what? I stole his cord. Good, go chop it. Chop it. Yeah, and it's nice Not because we'll use this as a hub wall, as as our house, and we'll use yeah. the other place as as the HCT. Yeah, and I think uh, and, we'll, and we'll have we'll have one storage box in there, nothing else, because I don't want people storing shit in there. We'll right. Have one storage box. And that's where we put our repair kits. So our I think pigs, our advanced repair kits. I think we should do an office space on one of the doors, and on that oh. one, on that one, that'll be the managers will only have key, like like only f so many people have keys, and five top yep. people will have a garage in that one. That's where we'll keep our trucks or whatever, just so we free up the space for the other ones in the other ones. But yep, you know, because somebody's gonna need to use it, so we can just have an office that only so many people have. Uh, me, me, you, Nori, uh, Pokey, and. Uh... The, probably the chief of police. I'm also going to offer Nori as part of the contract. I'll give her a login to the employee portal if she wants access. Um, yeah. But we got to remember the chief of police has to have access to this warehouse too. So we got to give him keys. Yes. 100%. And right. that's where it's going to be. Like, so we're going to have to call a meeting after we... we not, I don't want to talk about it much with normal employees. We need to talk to Bo because he's on the team like that. Yeah. But then Bo, I think we Bo, should... Bo's, Bo's more like... Uh, our gap between the hobos and he's not a yeah. hobo, but he's like he's run. Well, he's kind of I wouldn't say running HTT. Well, obviously not running HTT because that you know mainly it's uh, um, you know me, you, and Pookie, but mainly you, honestly, <laughs> if we want to talk about it. Um, but Bo is more like a uh, supervisor in charge. Yeah, I mean he's he's our eyes and ears when we're not in, exactly. you know, exactly. and then and that's so he's making it places real quick, so. All right, let's go outside and fuck with it. Let's be, let's deal with it. Oh, damn. You can do everything oh, you need. One. You what don't need no. Uh, we went outside, Is this a Gangor's car? Hey, this guy. Bill. Bill who? Do what? Hey, Ernie, this guy right here is looking for a job. Really? Hey, we can put him through an interview? Yeah, let's do an interview. Well, let's talk to him. He said only he has like 32 oh, cats and he needs a way to feed them. He hey, what's up, homie? That shit, that's fucked up, man. This man don't like Bill Cosby. What's you fucked up? Man, this man is talking about his friend Bill Cosby. Oh, that. <laughs> oh, Dale. Hey, what's your name again? Oh, my name's Will, man. Will Dickham. Will Dickham. Hey, nice to meet you. Hey, nice to meet you. Hey, what's your name, man? I like that hat. Uh, thanks. It's Ernie Gimp. Ernie Gimp, man. Hell yeah. Nice to meet you. You too, man. So, you looking for a job? Hell yeah. Uh, what kind of uh, experience oh, do you have? Uh, responded on my Twitter. And Was that I one of y'all? Uh, I'm not damn. sure. Not sure. What happened? So, do you have any work experience or history? Let's go to, let's go to our office. Yeah, let's go to our office. Hey Pookie, you wanna come here? I gotta go somewhere real quick, come on. Okay. 
Hey, if you guys think about if you guys think about sit chair F. Yeah? Yes, sir. Chair too nice. Sit chair F. Yeah. All right. So you're looking for a job? Yeah, man, I need a job, man. What the hell All is right. that? And what uh, kind of experience do you have? Uh, mostly uh, overhead welding, you know. Okay. And have you, uh, how long have you been in Los Angeles? What the fuck, look at this shit. Oh, I've been here maybe like a week or so. Okay. I you have... For the open interview? Yeah. Get it, open interview. Everybody hey, going Bo! Right, Bo. Just the person we needed for later. Hey, come on over here, Bo. Oh, yeah, we want to talk Come over here, Bo. Oh, We're gonna need to talk to you. I, we'll talk in private. Oh, damn. So you don't gotta talk to me. I know, you're good. Yeah, you're, you've been a good boy. So, do you have any work history in Los Santos? Well, I used to tow cars, man, and then I was getting, uh, beat up, and they steal my tow truck, and it just was really a losing battle. Really? Did you get shot? I did. Really? Why'd you, you get... familiar. Did you used to tow with a man named Victor? Oh, well, no, I don't know who that is. Okay. Never met no Victor. On Dale, you better eat and drink. Oh, I forgot for? that too. I'm gonna die. Uh, I've been mm. towing a couple of days. I ain't made no money though. That shit don't seem like you make no money unless you got some, uh, you know, some friends with you. Well, it's, I mean, it's just, uh, I mean, we don't even charge for our toes. Oh, shit. What in the fuck? Uh, like three days, I made about 10K. Well, you forgot to eat and drink, dumbass. Nobody drive them to. Box. Yeah, could you do that, Strawberry? Yeah. Thank you. We'll deliver it. Not you. We'll conclude this uh, <laughs> once you get back. Yeah, we'll wait for you. Don't worry. Yeah, we will finalize this once you are capacitated. Have fun with the chair stuck in your ass. <laughs> what the fuck? Hey, everybody. Well, this that's interesting. A, this is a public announcement. Make sure you're fucking eating and drinking. Hey, Bo, that car's you're... on fire. Hey, Bo! How how the fuck did that car catch on fire? Hey, Bob. Trust me. I ain't... Oh, yeah, yeah. Sorry. I was just playing my Flappy Birds here. Ain't no, no fucking, fucking way. What the fuck just happened? Hey, Bo, come join the circle. Okay. Oh, God. Yes, sir. Oh, God. Oh, God. A dog. Uh, what's the dog's me. name? Bo. Charlie. Hey, Bo, you want to go for a quick Charlie. ride? Why? Yeah, where are we going? Oh, let's take well, him. Well, no, let's go. Let's go. No, gonna, no, no, not yet. Not yet. Let's wait. Let's show him after. Okay, then we'll talk about it after. I don't want to. I don't want to talk. Don't worry. It's nothing bad, Bo. But uh, we want to show you You're something. You're fired. You're fired. All right. All right. We'll pack my bag. No, no, no. We got to show you the ocean first. Oh. So you okay, forget right. about us. Oh um, damn. Well, wait, what? Huh? Stuck, hold on. Wait a minute. I'm so confused. Uh, Let me learn how to swim on my tablet. Are we ocean dumping Bo? Bo's yeah, fired Bo, and we're ocean up, dumping put him. Up, put your hands up, Bo. This is what you get for backstabbing get us. Get your fucking I'm hands sure up, get... Bo. How dare oh, you talk God. shit on us? How dare you, wanna, you turn you on us? Do that? You wanna turn on us? Yeah. You know what huh? turning looks like? If you could turn huh? back time, you probably wouldn't have turned on us, would you? Really? You're just gonna sit there? You're gonna point Mama. a gun, too? Yeah, I'm the ringleader. Wait, Willie, he made us do this. He made us do this. He yeah, made I'm us. Angry. You know what? I'm not even Willie, angry Willie anymore. Willie's this. gonna have to do it. <laughs> Move it. Get, get on you your face. face. I'm arresting bitch face right now. He's floating in air. His calves are fucking huge. There you go. That's right. Oh, yeah, oh my god. Humongous. You guys see that car crash over there? Them two idiots collided into each other. Them tow trucks over there. Who the fuck them idiots? Right okay, but seriously, you're not getting uh, yeah, that's ocean dumped. Good. You're fine. Oh. That's 100% Nadia's people. Yeah, they don't know if I can drive. Not at all. Wait, is that little? Is that Jack? That might be Jack. So let's just say uh, we have a potential growth no, opportunity. No, 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 no. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's all. Something that oh, you, okay, sweet. something, something that's gonna tickle your pickle real fucking good. Hey, uh, while you're on your tablet, though, you might want to look up lessons of how to swim. Oh, yep, already on it. Oh, yeah, I kind of saw your screen over there. Could do anything you did you need 
You don't Looking need nobody on you. Oh, Just believing will really set you free. One time. Darling, what the fuck are you doing with the dog? I'm taking his picture. We don't take him, huh? Aww. Look, Darlene over taking pictures with the dog. Hey, you me get you a picture, Darlene? I wonder why I wonder why he was circling our warehouse though. That's the only thing I'm worried about. Like he seems kind of like how how do you like I don't know. Alright, yeah, take my picture with him. Like does Ooh, he I maybe does he maybe know something about us that we don't know, maybe? And like he's like a plant? Like cause he was just like circling really crazy and now he just wants a job. Figure you guys might need some of that. Oh yeah. Make my own baggies for you guys. Let's see here. Look oh, on my shit. agenda. Where'd you get that nice fancy chair? Well, don't you worry about that. Hey girl. There's no one taking care of dirt. business over here. Say hello to my beautiful girl. She's a big girl. Do you know her name? Oh, you only wanted one of the bags? Oh, did I? <laughs> he only took one. Here, let me drop. Give y'all seven. Found plastic and then I uh, make it into some baggies. Hey, what's up? I don't know what the hell happened to me. Yeah, you probably didn't fucking, uh, motherfucking, uh, Eight, you, you dumb son of a bitch. Oh, I was saying, oh. Drake, I think I had something wrong with me. It's probably with the herpes syphilitis. Probably. Okay, so... Yeah, I'll do it. So I'll yeah, fucking do it. Yeah. do it. One time. So, first question of business here, um... Really... What are you, studying for the, like, royal test? Uh, well, the real question is, like he's, is this... he's reading I mean, the... How you hover like this fella right here? I think do that. I'm reading this. I'm reading this book by Bruce Wright uh, called "Blowing Camel Toes," and it's pretty Ooh, good. Sorry. Oh damn! Every time I blow camel toes, it smells like salmon. So, uh, so first question, <laughs> first question of business here is uh, with the interview. So. You were circling out there just a minute ago, like you turned around like multiple times. It was kind of creepy, if I'm just saying. So, like, what was up with that? Yeah, man, I tell you what, I seen a feather over here. He was on the couch, and I was waiting on him to get up and leave. I was gonna steal it. Oh, okay. So you saw some you, you were gonna steal the couch? Yeah, they had that couch over there in the corner and looked Motherfucker, nice. that, that, that's a couch I, I put my sister on. You ain't stealing shit. Yeah, you ain't stealing the sister my fucking couch. Make good use of it. I already broke it in, bitch. You can't have it. That's mine. Well, me and my cousin was gonna like ourselves you take, on that. You could take that one over there, though. Oh my god. Je Jean's gonna love that one. Gotta watch it. Just watch Yeah, that's my cousin. She let me put in her butt. Oh, it's my couch. Oh, wow. So, uh. Literally, a shit covered dick. Okay, so where. Me and my nephew's son, we need our computer to get her. He made the son of a bitch. His baseball bat got him killed. So yeah, it hurts so good. You got harpies on your cheek or something? Why are you itching it so much? Yeah, it's probably uh some residual. Yo, know. appreciate the likes, chat. Like Four likes away from sixty. Hit that like button, chat. Uh, Sorry, milk your cat. So yeah. Okay, so back to uh the interview. Uh, so cat milk little towing experience. Uh, have you worked for anybody in the city or? or... No, no. Have you uh? Have you, uh, made any contacts in the city and spoke with any people? I talked to a lot of people. Really? A lot? I met this one woman yesterday, man. She, uh, she gave me free food and drinks. Candy. Really? Hey, yeah. Candy. Real yeah. nice lady. Yeah. Fake TVs to them. No, I wouldn't fake. They was real TVs. What the hell are you talking about, man? Yeah, Candy's definitely, definitely a nice woman. <clears throat> what was her name? Candy. Dummy. He Candy. Said name was Can you Candy. not fucking hear? He yeah. didn't say any name, did he? He said Yeah, yeah he, said he did. He just agreed. As long as he don't say naughty. Yeah, was... shit. Fuck. I did meet that woman naughty and her friend, they was playing a song. It was pretty. 
Really? What do you mean that was pretty? Yeah, we ain't nothing they, they, they play as pretty. Over where sitting, sitting down playing a song? Hell, I don't know. I was towing and uh, <laughs> stole my tow truck, so I was going to run back over there and tell the police because I'm snitching, you know? And uh, when I come around the corner, they had them over there. They was playing a song. I said, hey. I said, uh. Can I borrow one of these tow trucks? She said, hell no, you can't have one of my tow trucks. So Was it at the tow yard? I don't know what it was. Probably at the fucking Bells or lot. They had oh. a lot of people over there. They have clothes on. This woman oh, had yeah, a that's... wedgie. She had a wedgie up her back. Wait, you... Back. Strawberry, you say over... Well, hey, was it over there by the clicking bell? I tried yeah, to take yeah, it out with my teeth. Been. She got mad. I don't know. Oh, it could have been. Hey, been sir. Uh, Will, was it over there by the clicking bell? I think so. I don't remember. I think oh, that's that was her, about that's, a month ago. That's her yard. That's where that's where they live. I have a quick question. What does Nadia look like? Motherfucker, you know what uh, Nadia looks like. You dumb so bitch. Yeah, you that's dummy. I don't know. Like and all she wanna do is she walk around and talk on the phone a lot. I was I said that's weird. She and they had this one cop named face. Oakley. He kept calling her and him and her was talking. I said, Oh, she must be snitching too. How much fucking time did you hang out with them? Maybe what? about 15, 20 minutes. Then they made me leave. Hold on. She was talking to an officer named Oakley? Yep, yep. I tried to let her give me the job. They had a job over there. They were going to tow. And he said he was paying good. But they would. They said told me to leave. Get the hell out of there. Oh, you were trying to work for Nadia? No, I was trying to take the job they got. I don't want to work for them. That's working for her. Yeah. Yeah, Great job, Bo. Hell yeah, I like to swim. That'd be nice. By the way, I probably should have made it aware that this uh, interview is being recorded for quality assurances. Yeah, yeah I figured tiny, that. Tiny, 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 tiny got a big dildo over my head. Yeah. It's a big That's a microphone. Thing. Interesting. So, do you, do you have any questions, Bubba? Is, rule number one. We don't talk to Nabi and Nabi don't, don't don't talk don't 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 talk to us. Yeah, I get it. Hell, like maybe I could get some information. You know what I mean? Wait, I was told rule number one was no uniform. Uh, yeah, no, you That's can't get information. Rule. Cause no, rule number one would be we don't talk to Nadia. Oh, I got it. I got it. Yeah. That's all. Did that. That's all that you as an employee need to know. It's in right, the a possible employee. It's in the past for us, and we're just focused on the future. Therefore, well, we do not talk. We're not done hiring you. I mean, yeah, we're not done. In, job, man. We're I not done look. investigating you. So, I mean, uh, what makes you want to work for HTT? And how did you hear about us? I don't know that I want to work for HTT. Somebody just I told responded on the Twitter, and this fella here with the strawberry suit on with the big hands. He told me, he said, "Man, the hobos, they make a lot of money." I said, "Well, shit." Well, I said, "What?" I'm not. No, you say you're making a lot of money. Don't be backpedaling now, a lot buddy. Money, yes. It depends on how much. It's okay, girl. Don't let him aggravate you. Well, you're fine. Yeah, I guess if you, uh, if you, if you tow a lot, you do a lot of work, you can make some good money. Yeah. yeah true, too. It's all in your work ethic. Some of these employees make more money than the managers. Yep. Yep. The employees actually make most of the money because they're out doing the tow jobs. Yeah, it's 1099. It's 1099. We don't keep the money. You it's 1099. We are going to be talking about like a little bit of fun share to try to help growth operations, but nothing overwhelming. Yep. Yes. And we are going to be working on that. I don't, maybe, maybe. Maybe, maybe we could just have one person have the bank card and everybody has the bank information and when they, they could trans, they could transfer the money into that bank. Maybe like not an every, accountant. Yeah, yeah, maybe, yeah, an accountant. Not everybody have access to the company bank card. Not happening. So we can pay $2.99 yeah, an hour. Idea, man. Well, we can uh, still can give everybody access to do it, so it still should work. Mm. Do you what? And, and, and then you fire somebody or they they, they don't, they generate quit and they wipe their company bank plus, account. It's not happening. Plus we can actually use it by paying for stuff. Yeah, and that's what it, like, that. so the company funds would eventually pay for the, yeah, like, well, repair kits and then you guys can, like, that way we can, because our plan is, like, I'm going to see if we can get a contract with a mechanic shop, like, if we buy X amount of repair kits, if we could get, like, some money off. about that after the interview. And things like that. 
What? Yep. A How much? A hundred bucks a pop. From where? Is a certain employee. She gives me and my friend discounts because she has a truck. Oh well, we're gonna have to get it. Let's go. Let's That's go. pretty damn good. I got a deal there. My cousin, yeah. She won't let me hit no more because my uncle daddy took my spot. <laughs> so, as an employee of HTT, <laughs> as an employee of HTT, what you do off the clock is your own concern, but when you're on the clock, you can't be carrying anything illegally in your pockets, and you can't be doing anything illegal, because we are, uh, securing, we are in the process of securing certain contracts that are going to require that, so. i tell you now, I'm going to smoke some meth, all right? I do not freebase cocaine, okay? But I, I'm, I do, I do a little tooting and I smoke milk. That's a good question, Strawberry. We'll get the answer to that. But, uh, yeah, so it's all legal, so, on the job. So we have to make sure that we abide by that because if we sign oh, yeah. the... Let's just say if we sign these oh, contracts, yeah. if we sign these contracts that we're looking for, it will put us under scrutiny. Yeah. So, yeah. So nothing illegal happens. Uh... You are expected to go through training, which is a minimum of four days following with Bo Five. here. Five. Bo has to sign off on at least the final training. You can you can ride with a couple others, but he has to sign off on the final, and then you'd be certified, and then you can drive on your own. Man, I'm getting a very strong odor of clams right now. I don't know what's going on. It's probably your upper lip. You smell like shrimp and clams. I don't know what the hell that is. Brian, appreciate that like. Uh, but, like? but yeah. Could be uh, in your beer. Coming from my left side. Oof. As an employee, you're expected to remain professional while on the clock and dealing with customers. So you obviously don't want to offend them by anything, uh, you know, offensive. You know, so you got to be respectful and, you know, oh, something man. somebody would want to hire. You know? Hold on, hold on, hold on. You say on Dale? Hold on, hold on. You say on Dale? Yeah, it's a song. Yeah. That's my daddy. He's definitely Dale. not your daddy. Dale is definitely not your daddy. He's definitely not your daddy. His name is Dale. No, he's not. Not Dale Earnhardt. Not Dale Earnhardt, our Lord and Savior. Oh, no. I, thought, I thought you meant Dale Dickens. Nope. No. Nope. Dale Earnhardt, our Lord and Savior. Oh, okay, okay. So y'all yeah, like a little rush hey. and they'll turn left action, right? Go lay down. You're breathing hard. Go away. What did you say? So y'all like that? Y'all like y'all about that turn left life? Hell yeah. All right. Uh, do us a favor and uh, go uh, across the street while we deliberate. All right, man. Hey, uh, y'all see my buddy around here? Uh, who? Hold it. Yeah, you can hold these nuts across the thing there. No, no, hold it too, Dick. What? All right. Great job, Bo. Great job. Thank you for that. Well, uh, send that uh, recording. That's interesting. Um, well. We all do. We'll let me tell. Uh, well, uh, are you kidding me? That might be the worst interview I've ever seen. All I'm gonna say, we're gonna have sexual cases left and right. What the fuck? Yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, Interview-wise, I don't. Uh, yeah, I definitely think that would cause like sexual harassment cases. Um, hey, I can't. Uh, I, I can't hear you, babe. Sorry, can you hear me now? Yeah, that's good. I was just saying. Who's that out there at the fucking street? That's a woman. That ain't not a is it? Right. I will shoot her right now. Who is that? What? What? Hey, you ever, you ever, you ever play, you ever get them scratch-offs? Is that somebody with yeah. Nadia? I have no idea, really. Bro, 
the, the scratch offs you ever played him? Yeah. I went Who to the gas that? station and got me a scratch off, and I didn't win, and neither did anyone else. Really? Hi. Holy! Is shit. he getting her number? Who are those uh, towers? I don't know. He's getting five hundred dollars from her. Oh so yeah, he's, he's scamming him. He's scamming him. Scamming them while on a job interview? We'll see. You said you got a thousand dollars for what? Alright, let's come back up here and deliberate. Actually, let's ask him what that was about. Yeah. He said he hit her. <laughs> well. Okay. Alright. So. I think the issue I'm most concerned about is the liabilities of sexual harassment cases and stuff. I mean... Yeah! <laughs> I was, uh... Ba Yo, Baba! Sorry, sorry, I'm... 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 Dead. Uh... Here, let's come up this way. It's warmer up by the fire. Here you go, I'll make you another bag. Hey, thanks! I don't know, what do you guys think? Uh, about him? Yeah. I don't know, man. Maybe, um... Uh... I don't know. Uh, 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 I mean, I, I just want to know why he was hanging out with Naughty. He said he was hanging out with Naughty. I just want to, I still want to ask him why. Yeah. Yeah, I'm kind of concerned about that. Willie, you were going to say something? Yeah, I'm trying to see, uh... I don't really know. I don't, I don't, I don't really fucking know, really. Brian, with that like, appreciate it. Little, uh, he kind of left me speechless today a little bit. I don't... I don't know, uh... That was a wild-ass interview. Yeah, that was, uh... Definitely a little off-putting, if I must say, on the, uh... The innuendo side for the business, if you know what I'm saying. Um, I think you're right, Bubba. We should probably get down to the bottom of that. If what was that about? Like, yeah. He seems like more, uh, way more hobo than he would be fucking uh, a worker. You know what I mean? Like this dude right here would probably uh, get us into some shit when it comes to like a call. Unless he can express that he can fucking relax on the, the sexual remarks and shit to, uh, to random ass people. You know what I mean? Right. Oh, yeah. If, we, if we're going professional. Wait, what did he say? He said, hold, hold these nuts or something like that. Too. He said a whole lot of shit. <laughs> yeah. his, his we his lost track. Sound, his nails soon. Bo's got the recording. He can play it back if we need. Yeah. Well, we'll, we'll get. Hold on, I gotta, I gotta think about. Somebody smelling number? like shrimp and clams or something like that. Oh yeah, that. Yeah, let's get his number and tell him we'll call him back. I still, I, I want to question him while I was at Naughty. I want to make sure okay, he's not undercover. Okay, so have him come back, question him, and then get his oh, number and tell him we'll call him back and tell him to be on his way. Oh, how's it, uh, how's the training been? Good, good. No, me and Strawberry been going, going at it a couple times, so we've been getting some toes. Nice. Um, uh, mainly just city toes for now. He does have an ad out, and then, uh, his will get buried. I'll put my ad out. We haven't really got a PD call. He said he actually just got one while we were standing here doing this interview, so. Oh, Lord. Yeah. Oh, fat man got me a gun. Oh, so oh, far, it's doing really good. I got a question for you, son. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Why was you hanging out with Nadia for so long? Are I you... thought somebody huh. told me it was called Nadia's Blowjobs. I just wanted to go over there and see what he was about. <laughs> but you sat there for 15 minutes with him while they sung oh, yeah. songs? And... Sometimes and... you got to let them warm up, you know, before they give you the blowjob. What are we doing? Yeah. I'm making wiener. Yeah, I was trying to give her my wiener, what she said, but she wouldn't let me. Oh, yeah. No, I said I'm cooking hot dogs. So I was over there, I told him that I used to, I used to pose for Honcho. 
Spread eagle. Hey, my butthole open. What's going on? Uh, we're questioning him. Oh, Lord, I love to swim. Because he knows this area now. But if you know. Oh, man, your hand's so big and your, your gun's so small. He was with Nadia, and that's what makes me worry, man. Are you for Nadia? Are you yeah, on the yeah, yeah. Are you trying yeah, to get Darlene, information? Quest, yeah, Darlene, question his bitch ass. Question him. Question no, him. I, I was just over yeah. there trying to get a blowjob. Yeah, they Darlene. said it was Nadia blowjobs. Get the information out of him. Answer what her mean? questions. I know. I'm not lying. Are you, are oh, you trying to get information right and to take back to that slut? I mean, she... <laughs> I wish she was a slut. She yeah. wouldn't let me... No, you didn't answer her question. She said, she is answer. Say oh she's not. She said, are you trying to get information to take back to her? I know. I don't take nothing back, man. That was a whole lot of meant to go. Let me tell you, I'll gut you like a fish right now if you lie to me. Yeah, I knew I smelled fish. She, what, what she'll do is she'll stick a... Uh, oh, you missed. She'll stick a, a oh, fucking... Oh, you missed again. She'll stick a knife in the head of your dick and cut it wide open and split. Ooh, yes. Oh, yes. Whose tow truck is that down there? Like who's, hey, whose tow truck is that down Mine. there? She'll okay. she'll circumcise you, you a second time. Like I need to fish? be circumcised. I got duck Darlene, there. Darlene, hit him one time. Oh, hit me one time, please. Like hit, him. hit him, Darlene. Yes. Yeah, bitch. Oh you said she smells like fish? He likes it. He likes Kinda it. Kinda like that. Oh, do it again, Darlene. Do it again. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. Oh, that hurt a bit. Oh. Oh, oh shit! Oh. You really you pissed her I off. Lower. I don't know. Oh. All right, go easy, darling. Now, listen. Don't you swing back, you dumb bitch. We don't play around with Nadia. You hear me? We, yes, ma'am. We catch you over there, or even talking to anybody that associates with Nadia, we're gonna gut you. Ooh, darling, you're making me horny. I'm so. Yeah, I mean, me too. It smell like hey, shut your mouth. I better, not, I better not even smell you over there. Yeah, you're gonna smell me for sure now because oh, yes. you put your hands on me. Kind of beating the shit out of him right now. She takes okay, charge. So, is it okay if I come here? I'm gonna, oh, I'm gonna leave a recipe to Ernie because he's kind of in charge of all this shit. But if I catch you over there, I swear to God. Can you put I'm your fingernail? It smells so bad. Strawberry yes. jump. Someone turn. Oh. I'm talking about my fingers. Hey, who is this? Oh, it's been a taxi? Yeah, it's me. Boy, you was about to get one to the head. I, that's why I said I turned the car back on because I knew you guys probably get the food. What do you think? Get his number? Call him back? No. Well, he's a scam artist. He's disrespectful. I don't want. Yeah. I'm going inside. I'll be right back. And he's very rude. Or just strawberry slice him up like and ocean dump it. Yep. He kept saying, and then he said my fingers smelled like fish. Son of a bitch. In that, what? What did you say? Hey, you, you're paying dues right, right now. What's it I took some stuff off of him. Dildy. I know. Man, you ran my pockets, man. I worked uh, a long time digging the trash for that. I took Act like you're going to Ocean Dump, but not, right? Took a bunch of items I took Take home. him down to the ocean and then be like, alright, we'll call you back and then leave. No. They don't want to make and I'm keeping them, you hear me? Just oh. because just because you were hanging out with her, that whore. Tur, you tur. Hey, Willie, put your hands up. I'm going to put it in your pocket what I, what I just took. All right, give me your number. Wait a second, I have an yeah. idea. Where do I put this? All right, I'm gonna put it uh all on the right side. I don't like right. it. I don't know about you. All right, this is what, everything I just hit. Boom, boom, boom. I know I have no leeway, but I have an idea. There you go. Look, you it's on the right side of your pocket. Trust them. Oh Jesus Christ! It smells fishy. Yeah, I know. It smells fishy over here. No, you smell fishy. Yeah, cause you hit me. You hey, can I give an idea when he goes? Listen, she gonna knock your ass out. You keep saying that. We're gonna allow her. We're gonna let her knock your ass out too. Mhm. Mm yeah. 
All right, go stand over there for a minute again. Don't do anything stupid. You don't get hit by a my truck name, either. My name's stupid. Yeah, it is. Yeah, we know, Will. We well, trying to figure that out. Trying to figure what out. All right, so what do y'all? I mean, honestly, what are you thinking? I say, I, I say like we. we <clears throat> I've had only bad interactions with him. Wait. He was scamming okay, candy. Hold on, hold on. Y'all stay right here and talk about Selling fake 85 inch TVs. God, what's she about to do? I'm grabbing something out of the warehouse for a second. Is everybody whispering? Get a knife yeah. in case we need to gut him. That's all. I said we use him as bait with Nadia. We try and sabotage her with him. How? We can't jeopardize stuff. The, we can't jeopardize the waves we made tonight. I don't think you know the full thing about Nadia. I know there's a restraining order, and she had people shoot you and her. Yeah, but we're not. We're not going. We're not doing anything to her. You know what I mean? We're not. Okay. We don't want to stab. We're not doing anything done. like that. Do some, don't do it too close. I have hit one of her drivers. Yeah, we're not doing anything. But yeah, we're not. We're not fucking. We're, we're not doing nothing like that. Hey, y'all see that pink Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And we have to be careful because we had. Let's just say we're having conversations, and we got to be careful That's with things we do. Say, I only That's did it as retaliation. Say. They pitted me. No, we don't retaliate. Well, they don't know I work for you. It was my first day. Listen, our our Lord and Savior Dale is watching over us right now, and he's putting good things in motion for us. Things are happening that are great. Real great. Honestly, honestly, if we're trying to keep the business. Why do you playing? say it like that? Honestly. Honestly, honestly you don't. You say it with the O, not an H. You, you well, make the eight honestly, silent. Darlene, honestly, I, honestly, Darlene, I do have to honestly. say, when you had your finger out and you were, like, standing all still right there, like, I had the perfect view and it was fucking hot. Like, Darlene, that's the most control I've ever seen you take. Like, oh my god, I gotta... Knock it the fuck out of I don't Willie's think wife. You... Yeah, don't think you... she's my sister. You did, your, did, your, did your pants get a little tired? tired? Yeah. But I can't, cause I didn't like it. I, I like can't, it. because I can't. No, I've given you so much shit for fucking your sister. She's basically my sister. Jesus, my fucking god! Watch this. I'm gonna pluck. Nope. No, you didn't. I just don't. No, cause I don't say where he's getting a job. Don't, don't. Yeah, 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 yeah. I just don't know. I just don't know about it. No, 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 no. No, no, no. We could tell him. We'll call him later. Yeah, well, let's I feel like right. uh, he could get us into some very deep shit. We need to deliver on this. I'd say we give him one chance. One. No, I say we call him back friendly, tomorrow. Friendly folk over here. I mean, I'm down. I'm like, let's deliberate. Well, we did just fucking tell the. But we yes, I was about. I mean, that's what I was literally about to say. That every, we give everybody one chance. This is a place for fucking uh, you know. Up to come yeah, but but yeah, but when Ernie together. said we're not gonna be doing nothing illegal or yeah, anything like that, he was like, "I why well, I'm gonna be smoking meth." Well, that's all, if he does if he does it off the clock, that's on him. Oh, wait, well, he, hang I on. don't think he, I don't think he meant like that. I think he meant it. All right, uh, we've deliberated and we'll call you within the next uh, forty-eight to seventy-two hours with the decision. All right then. All right, have a good day. If we tell you don't be doing no drugs or nothing while you're on the clock, are you gonna be doing that? I'm gonna be doing meth, that's for sure. See, see. You can't be doing meth on the clock. All right, we'll call you. Uh, all right, I'll, I'll just do in... meth on the rock, not the clock. All right. All right, sounds good. She's sure. definitely she's too, evil she's a woman. Two -faced narcissist. Hey, Fuck. Hey, let's right make one here. thing clear. If anything leaves here, we never, we don't any know anything about guns pointed or anything. Yeah, we didn't. Okay. We've been towing all night. Probably go hang out with Nadia. We told him we'd call him in 24 well, or 48 to 72 hours. What are you doing with that suitcase? Uh, I was, I was so Darlene just. About... 
going to that couch right behind you. Oh, you going to bed? Are you oh, moving over there? What do you think? What do you think about the whole day? The thing about that? So Darlene just went over to him and said, oh, "Verbatim." Was. Check it out. Darlene just said verbatim, I need to clarify something with you. And she said, if we told you, she said, if we told you that you can't do any drugs or illegal activity on the clock, are you going to do drugs? And what was his reply? He said, I'm going to be doing math. He said, I'm definitely going to be doing math. Uh -huh. Oh, well. And then she that's said, fucking, no, that's that's a, a, that's a, and then she said, you can't, she said, you can't do it on the clock. And he said, well, I won't do it on the clock. I'll do the rock. Sorry, sorry. I'm not searching for wires. Ready, do you get that money? What money? I gave, is your ID 10? Take your cash. Uh, Maybe what we need to do... How much did you give me? 500. Oh, yep. Got it. Rules. Put that towards the company. It sounds like okay. he's going to be a rule breaker. Yeah, the company rules? He's going to be a company rule breaker? Mm -hmm. I think so. Yeah. Yeah. My can... Is, uh, so here's my concern. All right. My concern that he, my concern is that he's not grasping the concept that we're serious when we say no rules, no illegal running. activity. Yeah. yeah hey, like, like, and that's my concern. Well, and my, bed, but I want Bo to see. Can we have the conversation my on the way there or over there? Yeah. My concern is that he won't. My concern is that he'll conform at first, but then slip. Like he'll. We'll always have to keep an eye on him and get like we just need his buy-in if he's gonna work for us. We can't afford something to ruin it. Yeah, I, I'm a felon and I have a gun. Just don't. Have a gun as well. Yeah, it's not my prediction. Yeah. Uh, well, that's something we do have to talk about. As you know, we're felons. Are we gonna be allowed to carry? Probably not. We'll probably have to carry like. A knife, I'm gonna go in my like head for a second. Screwdrivers or crowbars. We're not gonna be able to carry this thing right here. Yeah, Honestly, so we've right. got to deliberate on contracts and we may have to settle for certain things because we're working on yeah. some stuff. Um, but, but, I'm working on some towards my expungement anyway. There you go. Then what, what do you mean you're working on your expungement? You called me yesterday or two days ago. Hey, Bubba, you want to rob a store? I have a good getaway driver. Yeah, but He's look. Been caught once out of. I haven't seen you dressed like Lemonhead in a long time. If he gets away, there's nothing he's got to sponge. Right. Hey, let me, anyways, let me see your sexy face without a mask. It's my actual face. It's probably hideous. Only That's his real face. Like that, no, I've seen it because you showed it to me once. Yeah, good for you. Let's show us. Hide. Let's hide. No, just show us. Okay, this is technically my face, but here. What the? Whoa! Oh my goodness, when did you get the tattoos? Wow. That's new. My last time... That is new. Time before last? I got it when I was in... I had it when I was in prison with Bubba. We got to that Wait, fight. do they allow you to go in um, PD and all that shit with the strawberry mask on? I say it's my face. But it's not. Hey, Ernie. It is. I actually put a mask on. Hey, honestly, I think he would be a much better... Uh, Bob, come on with us. I don't Strawberry, think he's we'll see. A, well, we gotta go do... Uh, I don't think he'd be a good friend for HCT. I think he'd be a much better hobo. Love you. All right, let's go over there and talk about it. Yeah, I mean, hey, honestly, he I would fit that. He would fit that like. much better than he would AC. Yeah. Could suck yeah. Your dick I have a feeling right. that. If All we, right. I have a feeling that if we. Uh... Yeah, very, very bad. I think honestly, well, honestly, hey, maybe we can. Out there? Maybe we can we're take gonna, him on as a panhandler. Uh, possible new spot. That's where we're going. We're going to go show Bo. Maybe we can take him on as a possible panhandler rather than fucking hiring him to HET. What if before we even went the panhandler panhandle route? A possible person to be part of the hobos? Yes. Where would my car be if it's not at the impound lot and I can't track it? It'll be uh, in your garage where you normally get it from. Yep. It's not here. Try Legion Garage. All right, so Bo, this place, uh, let's not talk about this conversation outside of this until, uh, uh, contracts are established. Yeah, I mean, some people do know, like, lawyers and stuff like that, but not really a lot of people. I mean, and, and, oh, what, what's going on down here? It looks like they might need a tow truck. Let's pull up on them. 
They do. They definitely do. Oh, no. Ma'am, do you need a tow truck? So is he higher than fire? Oh, okay. Are you sure? sure? I'm positive. Here, let me... Here. Do you have a... Here, give me the repair kit. Let me fix your car and you can do your bandage. It's, it's a SpongeBob bandage. I'll be okay. That's all I got. Okay. That's all I can do for you. We're with hobos towing and taxi, so we're just here to help. Yeah, yeah I'm the hobo. Hobo towing and taxi. Okay. Okay. Was it there? No, what? it's not here. It's not at the empire. It's not in our garage. Oh shit! What is oh, this place? Yeah. So welcome to the potential possible, possible new home of HTT. Yep. The no shit. Yep. So right here. The, I guess home base. This will this will be the mechanic bay if we get it. This will be yeah, where we can work on our vehicles. Um, so basically we Say met. With your chest. Basically we met with uh, a real estate agent to possibly look at buying this, right? And they told us because unfortunately it's still uh, owned by PD because it's an abandoned PD building, right. and so they said that they couldn't uh, authorize the purchase. Will. So we uh, called a few Can contacts. Kick me. kick me. I can't get up. What happened with Thank you. Ah, oh, damn. <laughs> damn, chill. <laughs> All right, anyways. Hold on, Pokey. I'm going to get that call. Continue. Continue. Does anybody what have a drink? Well, uh, no, I do not. Hey, but, we, uh, I, got, I got some water. Take what you need. That's all I got. I can't drop? believe I, I still can't believe I found this bread in a fucking trash can. There, I only took two. Oh. <laughs> so, anyway. we ended up speaking... We ended up calling a couple contacts, and we ended up meeting with the chief of police. Uh-oh. And he came down here with us, and with Pookie's lawyer at first. And we had a really long discussion, and it was... We went all around in circles of, well, we could oh, buy yeah, it. He just followed we could buy it and do a, uh, like, sign, like, an agreement. The reason why we we had to get talked to the chief of police was because, um, when we went to buy it, the DA's like, well, I can't sell it to you because it's owned by the city because it's a police department, right? right I over just there. said right. that. Oh, did you? Yeah. Did he say that? Yeah, he did. Oh, sorry. I'm gonna just shut up. <laughs> I love you, Bubba. <laughs> I'm, it's late. I'm tired. But yeah, I mean, Chief of Police, we talked. We also talked about the possibility of buying it, but signing like a imminent domain clause. So like if, if mm -hmm. you know, police did resume activity here and take over the building, you know, they could buy it back. And he basically, he didn't like that idea, but he basically said uh, he likes what we're doing because our plan is to branch out and hire uh, felons from, you know, that are coming out on parole. Like we're going to be like a... A place that judges can actually sentence them to working for us to right. um, rehabilitate. And so basically he said if we could draw up a plan, uh, you know, a proposal of like what we would need here. Like how many warehouses, how many offices, all that. And if we could have one person who does not have a felony at least sign the lease... And basically, he said he would consider PD renovating these buildings for us and then leasing them to us to operate out of. Great news. Great and, news. And with that lease would mean that in return, we would tow for PD for free plus tips. So it would basically be the same thing we're doing now, but it would be guaranteed free plus tips. Hell yeah. And that would be the... The leasing and so without like signing over the business to anybody else in specifically and keep keeping it more currently in the fashion of everybody having somewhat ownership uh we reached out to our lawyer nori and asked her if she would potentially sign the lease and she said that if we were to come up with a good contract and guarantee an open door policy where pd will have keys so they can come in and look at any time because they own the buildings, and then she would have keys so she can do spot checks to guarantee mm -hmm. that it's criminal free, then she would be willing to sign the lease for us to move in here. Hell yeah. That's good. And then that doesn't give up any ownership to, like, one person or anything that way to right. start. Like, it's still... And the PD will still respect and talk to all of us, and she'll basically just be the leaseholder. 
And we could still potentially go the route of, you know, petitioning for a legit business eventually. But for now, this will be a way to operate and have, like, a legal person's name on it with our lawyer representing us. Hell yeah. It's good to hear. Come so far from... <laughs> I'm telling nothing. you. I bet you won't post that on, on fucking Instagram. Uh, PD said that they like what we're doing. They believe, uh, they don't believe in, uh, what did he say? Monopolies or... Mm -hmm. So, he said we're all hireable and so they will ha continue to hire us. And they just want to... Basically, in return, they want to know that our, we're going to have ads up regularly and be working. So, um... And having strict guidelines in place, uh... So that's why we need to get together and get our guidelines in place and then corrective action for things and we just need to focus on making sure that people are crime free while they're on the job so that is correct. Yep. the chief did agree that he would not hold us accountable for what people do off the clock though it's but they we have to make sure that when they're on the clock they're flying right people make mistakes though so yeah. hey everybody go like my instagram post you know i know why you did <laughs> oh, that's that's perfect. Uh, on the on the shitter with the spotlight. So, what do you think of that, Bo? This is some great news. We definitely we definitely could use this whole area. We do we do have a lot of trucks coming in and out, so that would help. I like it. I think lot. people on the bridge. But bridge could hear too. Probably. Out of this very easily. We also want to say that, by the way, we appreciate all the work you're doing. You know, um, yeah. Yes. Us hobos, we kind of created HTT, but we kind of, I mean, well, Ernie's kind of put you really put you in the spot to like help with the the new people and help with the business aspect of things and and keeping that, you know, I mean, keeping that connection between uh, us and uh, the HTT. Right. So we just want to say we really appreciate all the work you're doing. It has not gone unnoticed. Yeah, you're out here doing a lot. With no that, problem, guys. with that, if you can start identifying your strong people as well with us, like, I'll keep an eye out, too. And stuff. Like, we're still here towing, too, but, like, if you could start identifying people that you think might be able to help with lead roles and things like that, um, you know, I still think you as head of training would be, like, would even in the beginning, even if somebody got a management position outside of like the main founders, I still think that you would be kind of above them and helping coach them in their management direction as well. Yeah. Right. And, yeah, if, and if anyone's ever given you any problems, definitely let us know. Will do. Will do. So far, everyone's been tip top shape. Everyone's I'll be that asshole and I'll the fire them if they're giving you problems. I don't give a fuck. Well, luckily, we haven't got to that stage yet. So. I'm just saying. I will say. I also wanted to say I uh, commend you on your uh, post in the employee portal earlier, getting everybody to follow suit with the directions of reacting uh, yep. and everything. That kind of stuff shows the leadership of keeping on top of everybody, and that's mm -hmm. what I want to see. You know, continue is just because we've all got to. You know, we got to keep up with announcing things and reminders because you know that's how it always works in a company that's why people are in management yep. positions because you continue to keep the standards in place exactly. and the clocking in and clocking out very important as well because that way you know who's who's been putting in the hours now with that said that true. we haven't done a good enough job hammering down on the non-illegal stuff yet and really monitoring it and so with that being said if we're starting to go this route that's something we're going to need to roll out in training and announcements and strictly enforce and get everybody all hands on deck immediately you know i know that nobody's committing crimes on the clock but i don't know if they're carrying you know drugs or anything well, like that yeah and we need to make sure nobody's if, carrying. If they commit, if they commit crime off the clock that has nothing to do with HCT, that's on them. That's their lifestyle. You know what I mean? And you, you think? Do you think? You know? Uh, you think I ain't gonna do some stupid? Oh shit yeah. Later? Yeah. I mean, you know, we'll, 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 that's who we are. But when it comes to HCT and the business, it's a hundred percent legit. One hundred. Yep. And Nori's gonna hold us to it, or there will be uh, things in the contract where she can walk away and we'll lose our lease and everything. So. I have, a, I have a feeling if we we hire that other guy, he might he might actually push her away too with the way he talks. Uh, you might be right. I mean, look look how she he was already talking to Darlene and then that oh, random female. I, I took over my shoelace. 
Daryl, thank you so much for that like. Destiny, Danny, appreciate it. 63 reactions. Sorry, I'm missing these. It's, this has been so intensive tonight, chat. Chat, this has been so immersive tonight. It's been hard to look yeah, away. I'm think, so sorry. Um, yeah, much love, chat. Idea for him to be hired under HTT. Maybe, maybe if he cleans up his act. What? Part, then maybe. Yeah. No, I, would, I wouldn't. I wouldn't do it. I wouldn't do it. No. Will, no. Will's thinking about making him Cause, like a panhandler. Well, yeah, because we'll I think I'm going to take him under my wing as a panhandler. Kind of mold him a little bit. Into a hobo? Okay. Yeah. We'll see. I don't know. We gotta get, I talked to Picky about gotta, it. Yeah, we got to get the feel for him, you know what I mean? Yeah, that's why I would. That's why he'll be a panhandler. Yeah, yeah, makes sense. He's I mean, much better suited for that rather than... Because he is homeless and addicted to drugs. Yeah. Well, I mean, just like anybody else that we're going to be hiring. They're, they're That's the kind of people crazy. we're supposed to be hiring, and we want. Yeah, true. And we got to show that we can make them <laughs> act right, so. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. And, 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 Thankfully, with yeah. a lot of the people who hire fresh out of court, they're going to have a parole officer, so they better act right. Yeah. But anyways, we want to show you this, that this is possibly in the works. We're also going to probably get cameras put around here. So if anybody doing any illegal oh, yeah. activity on, on this property, we'll know about it. And then, um, I mean, I, I mean, that's about it. We'll get these, these two warehouses right here. And, uh, yeah. And, uh, once we get in and we have some funds to get some decorating, we plan on having an office space and, uh, we'll make sure you have an office or, or at least a shared office with somebody. So. Oh yeah. No, I don't, uh, I don't want to ask for too much. Shared office is fine with Yeah, me. I can make, I can, I can. Give I mean, it'll just, office. it'll depend on how, how big it is. But if we have enough size to give everybody in management yeah. offices, then you'll get your own office. I think we should try. Um, Hell, I'll even take that little red uh, container over there as my office. I mean, really, I think, you know. My pocket's weirdo. If I, if we could get a medium warehouse, then I could get him his own <laughs> office. I could have found I, could have, honestly, this is what I, this is my opinion. Honestly, right? yeah. Wait, th this is my opinion when it comes to this stuff. Uh, a medium how a medium warehouse for the offices and a small warehouse for people to like have their, for for the uh, for the actual employees for them to go in and put stuff in the storage unit. That there's literally gonna be a right. fucking storage unit and some make some chairs, a table for them to eat at, stuff like that. You know, a break room, a TV, maybe a little TV or something. But when it comes to the other warehouse, if we could get a medium warehouse. I could I could uh. uh put a second floor in that bitch like how uh you know the other one or if we don't even want the second floor um we can, i could make it to where you know uh the uh, owners we're all you know us three we have our own our own office and then uh bo has one of his offices and then there's like a table or some stuff in there i could build those we don't need a large at all that's just no. too big and i would say in the offices we could put for the for the people who have been trusted enough to have an office then I would say we could put one storage in each office so that everyone can store stuff. But as for the employee section of the main warehouse, yeah. we'll just put one storage so we can manage what's going in there and stuff. Well, the, it isn't, um, when it comes to the manager's warehouse, that's, it's going to be the manager's warehouse for a reason. Yeah, um, exactly. But and, I'm saying... And the other warehouse will be for, for the employee warehouse. We can trust management to have their own storage in their office yeah, yeah, yeah. No, is what I'm fine, saying. You know. yeah, we, can put like, we can put like a safe in there for them. But uh, in, in, the, in the employee warehouse, we'll put like a, uh, what we'll do is we'll, we'll put like a filing cabinet in there, or not in a filing cabinet, but like a locker to where they can store stuff in there. They won't like, you know, prepare kids and, and advanced lock picks and, uh, you know, uh, uh, picks, you know, because they're going to need that stuff. Yeah. Yep. And food and water and shit like that. Yeah, I think, uh. Phones, radios. And I think what we should do is, in our contracting, we should put verbiage that we also do locksmith, minor locksmithing for when towing, when needed in towing. That way we could justify the amount of lockpicks we carry, you know. And yeah. that, that's just, that's not for anything illegal, it's just for, you know, locksmithing. Well, we put, yeah. I mean, we could, uh, when it comes to, like, if we want, we could have, we could put the, uh, Really, the repair kits, and um, that way it's not t that way it's not stolen or anything like that. We can put the repair kits and advanced repair kits and uh, or whatever the lock picks and stuff like that. We could put that in the managers. Uh, we could put one locker in there, and we could have the important items over there. You know what I mean? Because really, if we just put phones, radios, food, water, stuff like that in there, they could grab that all they want. You know, because that's what it's for. But if if they need uh, stuff, I don't know. We'll figure that out. 
We also need to figure out how they're going to, uh, it's, I mean, it's employee owned, but it's also employee ran. So they need to also put money towards, uh, like you yeah. said earlier. Well, I mean, that's the thing, because we need to be making money so we can show it. To... <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, we got to pay, we're going to have to pay rent to live here. I mean, to not yeah. really live here, work out of here, so. And that's what, we're... and, um, Nori said we have to show that we're going to be able to be making profit. So, most, Honestly, most of it's going to be employees paid. If and, we get a decent amount of employees paid, probably I would just say mm, maybe a pay, I don't know, uh, a thousand, a thousand dollars a week. Yeah, that might be, uh, or five hundred dollars a week or something like that, hundred dollars a day to be able to use the vehicles. Because some of these people ain't gonna be able to have, they're not gonna have tow trucks, right? And so they just, you know, they just pay us to rent from them so they don't have to go pay 250 to rent them from there they could just pay us 100 well because that'll be the the plan will be to have like five or six you know 10 tow trucks in a couple of garages yeah. and just leave sure. the keys in them and then make it yeah. a rule that when you're done make sure you fuel it up and fix it make sure it's yeah. in full working condition and make sure it's fueled up and then put it well, in the we, garage we're gonna have to figure out how much rent is gonna be yeah, I think we're gonna need to redo our license plates on them all, though, and instead of our yeah, names, it, switch it, them over to, like, like a truck one, number. H, no, HCT1, HCT2, HCT3, you know what I mean? Yeah, and that way we can call on it. Yeah. And then depending on, and then I think once we get to the point of, like, a dispatch, then, like, your Maybe. call sign will be the truck you're in, so, like, you know, truck one dispatching out to, you know, that plus one you know um tomorrow i'm actually gonna go down to lux autos and kind of talk to them about um maybe yo we'll see him thank you so much for that like because you know we're flash thank you for that like running this hgt and maybe we get a deal with uh instead of 1750 per truck we could get a deal with them you know what i mean maybe like if 14 50 or 15 i mean i think yeah. we've got enough trucks at this point to well, be honest for now, between for everybody now, how many have we got Five? Uh, we probably got like eight. I mean, fucking everybody owns a truck. Even Peter, Peter Cedar, Harry, like mm -hmm. eight. all the new people own trucks. Oh, really? They've got their own trucks? Mm hmm. The only one that I don't think does so far is Victor. I mean, the thing is, is it's, it's for the business running. It's a profit share. I mean, like, we're all invested owners, basically. And so with that, yeah. we got to put a little bit in. Like, I don't want it to be overwhelming for everybody working, but... A little bit, and all that is is to keep the lights on and further any future investments in repair well, kits, and the business will start running itself and stuff, you know, yeah. financially soon. Oh, as long as people are paying their uh, quote-unquote dues, because yeah. we're not we're not taking anything from them when they do their toes. And they're going to be towing for PD and getting a tip, Mass and you know, tips. if you tow enough, and that's the thing is, PD said. If they do it, they want to make sure that our ads are up regularly. He said it's yeah. all about, and he even said it's all about, they don't have time to just keep scrolling. He said it's about making sure your ad's up there, you know? So, like, I even, like, I if my ad starts to get buried, I've been deleting my ad and reposting it, you know, Maybe after a while. Maybe once every 30, 45 minutes, put it back up there. Yeah. yeah. And so he just, so they have somebody to call for a tow. You, you don't get, the thing about it is you don't get alerts on Yellow Pages. So you can put it up there, and then 30 minutes later... Yo, Travis, thank you for that like, and that follow, right yo, welcome, welcome. You know I mean? And that share, yo, he just hit the triple threat, yo! Let's see who this is. Oh, Strawberry's got to add up right now. Yeah, he texted me saying he got another officer to make us her go-to tow company as well. This is this is becoming amazing now. The, all, yeah. the police, police department is wanting to come to us. Yeah, I mean, but I think I, it's great. I'm sorry, I have to go to bed, man. It's yeah, I gotta go. go I gotta go to bed too. I'm, go, I'm actually going here. Bye. Bye. Have a good one. All right, I'm gonna go to sleep too. Alrighty, man. You guys have a good nap. Yeah. Sorry to keep you awake. No, it, you're good. I'll I'll probably be awake for a few more hours. All right. Well, have I a good don't night, sleep man. Much. No, yeah. You guys too. See I ya. Sleep maybe three hours. So right. Yeah. Same. It's all good. Y'all have a good. Night. All right, chat. We are going to end the stream here because I do need to get to bed. Chat, huge things are happening with this. This is crazy. This is wild.
uh what happened tonight is wild this contract will be huge like if we can lease this building that'll be a big thing for us uh that's freaking huge chat all right chat make sure you smash that like if you haven't already if you're joining us after the fact feel free to hit that like button if you liked the content hit that follow button join the bugsy stream uh we are at 1100 followers i think i think we might be a little bit above it chat um but y'all have a wonderful night thank you so much it's never goodbye on the bugsy stream it's always see you next time chat we will see you next time